and yo what is up guys it's air just cause here back at it again with ups f1 racing league and today we got the f1 ups racing league double header today we got brazil and austria should be a fun one welcome i am air just cause here i got somebody in the booth with me tonight uh we have no in-race commentator tonight uh for at least brazil but we're going to have one definitely for austria i got king caesar who is um st um not going to race brazil but he is going to probably race austria maybe does not know as of yet as um as we are here now um caesar you got a copy there buddy make sure you get your audio included. yeah i got it um, tonight, Brazil, very uh, interesting racetrack um, as well. Tell us, you know, what's going to be the challenges tonight for people out there, you know, and on the track, right, uh, joint, racing and qualifying. Air joint for real. They're starting. I'm in. You're oh, in. they're starting? I... The lobby. Yeah, I'm in the lobby. You are? Am I just blind? Yeah, I'm underneath. Yeah, I'm underneath. Oh, you. I'm blind. You guys scroll down. I'm, yeah. I'm stupid. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so the challenges is going to be, uh, you know, the curbs. Uh, I don't know what's going to really be the challenges. I guess what strategy you could pull, to be honest, because I think the strategy will really depend on, like, the safety cars, if there's any, and then just avoiding people because quite a bit of people. Some people drive differently than others. Some people are more aggressive, so you're going to have to avoid them a lot. Yeah, as, um, yeah, tonight's going to be a good double header here um starting with race one of brazil of the double header yep. um you know oh, brazil i forgot who won here last season i think it may have been chan um uh, no it was, know, uh, chan, MC. He won the it was mc finale. okay yeah yeah he won the finale this was championship finale this was the track uh chan won at uh for or won the championship at so yeah. this is definitely going to be a race where you might see a lot of wrecks here because a lot of people like to go side by side in corners that you really shouldn't go side by side in. I mean, passing zones tonight, two DRS straights, front straightaway, and also the straightaway after turn three. So you got two DRS straights you're going to have to worry about tonight. So let's see what can happen here as uh, we are in the, in the race or lobby for qualifying right now. Um, looks like so far nobody's pulled out of the garage. Hardly some yeah, rain. Is in it. it looks very cloudy, so I don't know. Yeah. I mean, very I wish cloudy. we could add forecasts. Yep, I wish we can add that into spectator mode. Maybe get a, you know, Quite a, bit a nice little look at forecast. Added. Yep, as currently cars are coming out of their pits boxes. Um, it looks like got a couple already heading out on the track. It looks like Cali might be the first one out. Here, let's go ahead and look. Telemetry, lap data, track map. He is the first car currently out on the racetrack. So, as he's currently out, let's see what can happen. Yeah, uh, Kelly, Kelly needs a good race here because a uh, CEO car probably ain't going to make it. And he could probably snatch second okay. points from a very bad start of the season because after like race six, he was like 19th in points. And lately, he's just been doing super good. He has a win, four podiums. Two poles, so I think he could do good today. And this is out. Hello. Okay, as I was sending links right now and to uh, some uh, on uh, social medias and stuff. Uh, right now, as Cali starting his lap here, let's go look here. Going in the one, uh, turn one, a very interesting turn one too. It's a very uh, elevation type racetrack, a lot of elevation changes. So you know, is that going to be a factor? Because I know at some tracks, as uh, Despacito has DNF'd out of the session or retired. Yeah. So uh, elevation changes tend to get your car light. We see that a lot of the tracks like Portugal um, and Imola. So tell us what is going to be, is that going to be a big factor here today? I think the, during qualifying, if probably go during the race, you could probably make a couple more mistakes. But during qualifying, you're going to really have to, I think the important parts of qualifying here are the first two turns. And then this sector two with all these S's, you got to nail all of those to make sure you get the good lap and get the pull. That's Kelly left. In sector three. Yeah, as it will, but 
you know, this is definitely going to be a very interesting race on the, uh, on this calendar, you know, it's always been an interesting race, uh, especially indeed, and then Austria coming up is going to be another, uh, very interesting, tough one, yeah, very good lap yeah, time from Cali, lap. let's see, next one, so, oh, okay. CB 108, 269, and he spins, you know, former champ, well, season two champion, um, you know, he knows how to get it done. Definitely. Uh, he's done a lot, done, has done a lot of, uh, Winning. league races, has won a lot of the races in this league. Yep. As, oh, he spins it again. <laughs> I don't think he's trying. Oh, MC just threw down. Ooh. Yeah, he just blew out, he just blew his lap out of the water. I mean, it's MC, he's very quick. Three. Yeah, two wins on the season. Um, him, you, him, and Joseph are the only three guys that have multiple wins this season. Yep. I mean, yeah, it's very inter It's very been, interesting. Um, I have the wins you know. for the season. I have four. Joseph and MCF two. Then six people have won. Yeah. It's KB fan, Sniper Hyper, Wendy Goop, Cali, Co Carnab. He has been a lot of different winners this season. 14, 15 different people on the podium, and eight pole yeah. sitters. MC has the most with three. KB fan, me, Cali, CO car have two. Sniper Happer, Notre Dame, and Evan have one. Mm, very so interesting get, indeed. My prediction is MC wins the poll. Mm -hmm. So let's just see what happens in qualifying right now. It looks like P4. P4. Right now we got about nine people right now currently qualified on lap time right now. Um, About Chan, Solizel. uh Drew and Top Shelf trying to make a trying to make a probably wait some time maybe hoping the track can clear up because we know when it gets um gets sunnier you know it's, the track gets faster so you know it's definitely going to be a factor whether sun or shade happens in this race there's a lot of shade it was the exact same thing in the championship race was a lot of shade on the racetrack right now because the overcast so. Yeah. Should definitely be interesting. Kyle Bush fan up to second. 108163. Only so, two tenths off. Yeah, very good lap there from the uh, Alfa Romeo. I don't even know who's on the lap. They've done, to be honest. Yeah. I think the Ferrari's on the lap. They have done an amazing job. Ferrari off the final corner, and their many comes on. Wendy Goop looks like he's on a corner as well. A that. lot of cars are going to come in. Is let's go ahead and look at chat. Sniper Hyper says, "Of course, I have to miss Brazil." <laughs> so snipers. Cali says, "Dang it, uh, we are going to Brazil." Sniper Hyper says, "I have to miss it. Hopefully, I can make Austria though." Cali, my lap was horrible. Top shelf, goaded Red Bull duo. Oh yeah, Drew's in the Red Bull today. Yeah. We'll see how that goes. Yeah, Drew's in the Red Bull today. I mean, Drew wasn't bad at Porto now. He almost, he, he ran like 6 to 8th all race and had contact with CO car, which moved him down to 10th. But if he would have had the race go green without a safety car, I think he could have got 6, which is a good result for Drew. Yes, it is. Definitely a good result. As, uh, Jake's on currently, a lap. Yeah, Jake's on a lap. My boy Gaming Jake, dude. I got to talk about my man Gaming Jake. I mean... Uh, he's not had the season he had last season. He's got he had multiple podiums, multiple great runs, but right now he's done decently in points uh, wise, you know. So you know, my boy Jake, I'm hoping he brings out a podium. He's like that. the I Browns; mean, they're underperforming. <laughs> yeah, that we underperform, and then you know we get a shocking win, and it's like, woo, yeah, yeah, let's go, Jake. It's so cold in California today. It's like 50. Yeah, I need to get my sweater. So Top Shell says I'm eating dinner, so that's why I don't have a lap. Do you like Lord that? have mercy. <laughs> he said, "Lord have mercy." <laughs> I'm gonna mute. That's Hold what on. Kelly said. I'm gonna mute. I need to uh, put on my sweater. So fucking cold. So, let's see, so we got lap time. Everybody's still on track. Boog on an outlap. Boog making his first start of the season. Um. Yeah, last win was at Australia in the rain uh, last season. He he dominated that Australia rain race last season. It Boog? Was, yep. It wasn't yeah, even close. he absolutely dominated. Yeah, it wasn't even close. He had to hold off everybody on a final restart, but then it was just like the race. Nobody was even close. 
It was like me at Abu Dhabi. Oh, he's, making... oh, he's making his first start. Drew Rocks. Top shelf still need to qualify as well as Chan. But I think Chan is heading out maybe? Or was that? Yeah, he's heading uh, out. Maybe when no, you no, Yeah, he's heading out right now. Mercedes is heading out. The champ. Defending champ, I should say. Hasn't done a good job of the defending part of the title. Um, looking like Chase Elliott. That's what he's looking like. Yeah. Struggling to get wins. Uh, I do need to ask your opinion. He has made a lot of enemies this season. Um, it looks like he, he's purposely wrecked Jonah over Me. something I thought it was Chan. Monza. Yeah, he yep. made enemy of you at Monza and also another track earlier in the season before Monaco. Yeah, um, he's all, or, yeah, Emila, and then he's also made a uh, I think uh, enemy of MC. He still hasn't dumped MC. He's been saying he's going to dump MC. Is today the day they dump some C? I mean, he's made a lot of. I feel like this today could alone. be the day because uh, Chan's been talking quite a bit in chat. So, about MC using a wheel, he's like mad about that. And I don't think they're on the best terms, so we could see definitely contact, especially since they're both very good here. Yeah, they are both very good here. Um, you know, especially because they finished one two here last season. Yep. So. You know, he won championship, MC won the race. It was a very good race, too. Um, it was just a very long run to the end. As here comes Boog, he's looking to see if he can put down a lap. He's about to hit the one-second mark here. Oh, Wendy Goop P3. It's going to be a good lap. Yeah, Wendy Goop up the P3. This is going to be a good lap here, maybe. P4. 108. P4. That's good with the mediums, because the mediums are probably yeah, like very six, good with the mediums. six tenths. Slower than the soft, so only being four tenths off some C. I think if he maybe the medium strategy could work here today. Yeah, as um, CB on soft, CB looking to put down a lap. This one, well, he was P2 on pole probably. at one point. P2 probably 106, 107. Oh, yeah, 107, nine. Top two, a little bit off of MC. Yeah. The champ showing he still got in him to be competitive Drew needs already. To That's why he hasn't done, done anything. Oh, yeah, he la I think he lagged out of session, yeah. Yep. Let's see, let's go ahead and look in chat. Um, Jonah Bolt. Chat, Jonah so. Bolt. Yeah, Jonah. Wow, 107, 8, 11. Nice lap there by Jonah. I feel like the track's getting a little faster. The rubber's being put in or yeah. whatever it's called. I don't fucking know. Also, I think more people are going on softs right now. I think everybody on their first run had mediums as well. A little incident right there between Gaming Jake and Haha -ha Boo. Top shelf, purple uh, sector two. Top shelf. Oh, here we go. You this know, is definitely going to be interesting. Top shelf. Oh, I think he might just be short. Top He's going to be maybe? definitely short of pole. Yeah. You're six, seven, Yep, eight. very short. P11. Wow, one, 1089. I guess the sector, the first sector, the third sector was went awfully wrong. Yeah. A little bit off. I think. Really, yeah, well, way off of Cali. Cali's DNF'd in 10th right now with a 108.5. And Drew's not here so, yet. I don't know where to. Guy says, I got, <laughs> I got, <laughs> I go get a water and come back to 10th <laughs> place. Who, Cali? I saw that. <laughs> Yeah, Cali. There's six minutes so, left. Uh, six minutes, yeah. If you want to get out, you can get out now and then come back. Maybe put on another pair of soft. The thing is, you don't want to use up your sauce. We don't know if this is a rain race or not. So, so you don't want to use up shits, sauce. Because we don't really fit enough. I, I think yes. it'll rain during the race. I think. That's my prediction. This is yeah, Brazil. The way it looks overcast. It's yeah. Brazil. This Boog's on a lap. Do a lap time Boog can put down. He's Jake's already got a 1082. Let's go look at tire compound everybody's using right now. Looks like everybody that has had a lap is currently qualified on softs. Other than Boog. Uh, except for Boog. But I think he's yeah. on a soft Boog's... run. No, he's on mediums. No, he's on a medium run. See what lap this is going to be here. He PR just... At... Oh, he's going to send it. Yeah, okay. Kyle Busch fans on that lap. Yep, Kyle Busch fan now on a lap. Alfa Romeo. I don't Good know. Good job by Alfa Romeo. Oh! 
and they oh we he he, uh, he tried to cut that course to get some time right there. I mean, <laughs> I mean, hey, I don't blame him for trying. I mean, Drew can't join. I don't know what the. I'm gonna, I'm gonna I should have never retired. I could have chewed at at like eight tenths off my lap. Who, Kelly? Take uh, take to go, Christopher Hernandez mode. <laughs> <laughs> Time to go, Christopher Hernandez mode. Uh -oh. You know a lot about that mode. Caesar. Yeah, back to the front. It's mm -hmm. gotta be smart. Yep. Porter might have to be. It said I gained like nine spots on the start of Porter Mouth, but I didn't really do anything. I just watched everyone just kill each other in front. And I just took up candy, basically, free candy. I think the person I battled the most with was Evan. Evan was very tough to pass, especially at the end. No, right now. Fun fact: I'm currently commentating from my kitchen. Um, nice. I can see my TV from here. I'm cooking up some dinner right now while commentating. It's been a a tradition, I guess. I've cooked up a lot of dinner while commentating uh, these UPS races. Yep. Uh, right now, we got some. Ra we're having some ramen tonight. Um, you cook? Some. Yeah, I cook. I, I can cook I, chicken. I I, oh, cook beef. Grown got disqualified. Oh, wow. I guess Disqualification. He's trying the Christopher Hernandez challenge. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Christopher Hernandez challenge. I did it. I think anyone could do it. Oh, Drew can't mm -hmm. join. I think a couple people have done it before, too. I think. Well, I think Chan's at least done it once. I've done it once. I mean. For like three seasons yeah. ago. I don't think you've done it. You've won twice. I've but... never. I've won twice. Yeah, I've won this track, actually. <laughs> Yeah, and this then, is only uh, one Vietnam. of my two UPS wins. In Vietnam, Vietnam sadly is not in the game no more. <laughs> not on the schedule. Uh, at least you got 15. You're still like seventh all the time in podiums, though. Yeah, I was very consistent as a driver. Just not consistently, like first Winning. place. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was very consistent. Like I was like maybe third. I, I would finish third through six every week. I mean, and then like in a new game, I was, you gave up basically. I gave up because I can't stand the new game. I suck at the new game. I was, I was oh, decent at 20. Now fan. this game makes me... Three tenths. Ooh, pole time. Three tenths. Wow. He got the toe off. Everyone's putting he down some lasers off, uh, right now. My name is John Guy. He got a big toe. Yeah, he. everybody's putting down some blazing laps right I now. I just noticed uh, neither Ferrari's here tonight. Oh, yeah, That's so Red Bull's going to get some good points in Constructors. You're going to be happy for that. Well, Drew and Top so far, since I don't know about good points. <laughs> no offense well, to either. Oh, you're going to diss your own driver? <laughs> God. <laughs> I would diss Drew. Technically, Drew's not your driver. I mean. Well, Drew's technically in, like, the Red Bull team. So, yeah. He's not an Alpha Tari. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. I've been seeing improvement from both of them. So, hopefully, they could actually be good. In a couple, yeah, maybe next season. I don't know. We don't know yet, but it has been a very good season for you. Of course, four wins on the season. Yep. Um, you know, but hey, it's been very great season too. A lot of close finishes. We've broken yeah. some history this season. I've counted I mean, that we've had six last lap passes this season out of fourteen races. Wow, that's a lot. That's that almost is half. a very good. Uh, yeah, over almost half of the season. Yep. Been full last lap passes. We went three in a row. I forgot what track. So I was looking at it yesterday. You know, I, I mean, uh, of course, if you had to say, what was the best, the best race this season? Well, I'm not sure. Racing wise, I'd probably say Bahrain because of just how close everyone was, especially yeah. at the end because Kyle Busch then got CO car. Then CO yeah. car tried the, the crossover, and then Kyle Busch then got him with the switchback. Then CO Car tried to murder him on the final corner, but he's Cobbles barely won. Yeah, I don't know. I think, fun fact. I think that was my favorite race to run. Yeah, fun fact about the two closest races of the season, which is the two closest races in UPS history. Um, both of them involve CEO Car. CEO Car's close Baku? finish at Bahrain, and then Baku, and Baku as well. And he was second. And Baku he was didn't win. Yeah. Ch Chan P2. Like it. it yeah, Chan P2 already showing that muscle of uh, how fast he can be. Boots on socks, sure, so. so we'll see. So see I... Boog's time, because Boog's time is going to be interesting. Drew still can't join. I don't know. 
Hold on. I don't want to back out. I think we might have to. I've literally invited him 20 yes. times. All right. Yes, guys. Even though Caesar's in the booth, he's still doing ownership from here. Um, yeah, because, you know, well, I have Jonah. I told him to invite people, and he doesn't. So, yeah. It's fine, though. I just qualify and go. I do in here. Fuck. I'm to rob her. True. So. Because I'm cooking up the ramen. Try, hurry up. Okay. Yes, they're trying. Boog's gonna go, Paul. Boog's gonna go, Paul. He's perfect. Oh, let's see. At the line. Oh, second. Second on the board. Boog went, Paul. Oh, he got pole. Yeah. Chan was only one second. What a job. Ha ha, Boog. On pole. What a final lap right there. Did you get in? No, he didn't get pulled. <laughs> oh, he didn't. It's so close. Wow, Kyle Bush fan pole here today. Third what pole a of the season. Time by Alfa Romeo right there. Good job by him. He will take pole. Oh, Drew, I guess you uh, might have to What miss. a good job right there. Yeah. So here we go as we're going to load in to the race, the Just Brazilian Grand Prix. Oh my god, it's pouring. Air. Oh god. Oh, it's pouring? Yes, you can. Just try. Oh god. Go to the well, other this party. is going to be interesting then. It oh. is pouring. Oh god. Okay, uh, I, my prediction is Google went by 40 seconds. Boog to win by 46. That sounds like a very good prediction. Dude, I mean, I cannot lie. I, th I mean, I'm cease. Oh, one shot. One shot, okay. Because I'm not okay, spending well, another 20 minutes in qualifying. Well, here we go. It's time is running down. Here, we're about to go green here from uh, the Brazilian Grand Prix. I don't know what the track's called. Does anybody know what the track of Bra Brazil's for? Interlagos. Interlagos. Here we go. Lights out. And away we go from the Brazilian Grand Prix as we head into turn number one. Good launches by everybody. So far, nobody's wrecked, but here we go into turn one. This is going to be crashing zone. Boog to the inside. Alpha Romeo to the outside, but the Alpha Romeo is going to have the inside. Boog Can Boog clear? Oh, no. Goodness. Boog. Oh, and around goes Alpha Three Romeo. People, Couple. Oh, four, five. The big one. What? In Interlagos. Well, do you repeat 10 without doing anything? Wow. I don't know. That is not a good start. Me? Right there. Wow, is already off the start. Oh, Brendan Problems. Oh, Brendan is already out. DNF, will that be a safety car? It's a virtual. VSC out. Very, very interesting start to this uh, Grand Prix. Have you tried? What? Already virtual safety car. A lot of ca uh, chaos going on early on. I don't know. I'll just count wherever you finish. I don't care. So, so right now. Well, it's horrible rain. I don't know how many laps we're going to Yeah, it's horrible rain right now. Hey, you remember I mean, who was good at the rain last night? Top Shelf. Who? Yeah, Top Shelf is but very good 14. in the rain. I what is he doing? Yeah, the thing is with Top Shelf, Top Shelf, I think, is a very underrated rain racer. Yeah. The thing is, unless he can stop making a couple of those mistakes he makes. Very I mean, stupid mistakes. I think, I mean, I think he can definitely have a shot no, at a good finish cool. today. I mean, as a VSC, nope. as, oh, cars are coming down pit road. Hold on. It might be wing damage. Boog's wing damage. Might be wing damage off the star, yeah. But Boog was out front. I don't know how he would get wing damage. Drive through? Somebody made contact with him. Hold on, Caesar. Check the um, check the um, race thing, race directory. See if okay. anybody got like a penalty. I thought I think it would be Boog's. Uh, Boog's out now. Yeah, they both got drive-throughs. And my need John. Yeah, could it? What? What was it for? Was it for contact under VSC with each other. or was it for with each other? With each other, okay. So contact under VSC. Jake's that puts before. Jonah to the lead. Jake's before. Yeah, Jonah's in the lead too Jake's right fourth. now. Good run. 
Let's go, Jake. Oh, Jonah spins. Oh, no, he actually did. The leader spins. <laughs> Chan leads now. Well, that was... That was short lead. That was short, um, short lived right there. Despacito's already on the podium. Yeah, Despacito already on podium. 11 spots. Grow wow. with 10. What a gain. Boo gloss, yeah, 10. Biggest, yeah, lost biggest six. gainers. Yeah, there you go. There's the biggest gainers of the race. As there's your strategy powered by AWS. Uh, we're not sponsored by AWS once again. Uh, <laughs> but we can be. Did they call up? Sure. Uh, yeah. And Wendy Goops, Wendy Goops retired. He's free at VSC once again. He is absolute. I think he paused. No, he's dead. He, I guess he ran out of oh, talent. Wow. Trouble once again. And Dan leads. <laughs> oh, God. Drew? Well, that's coming from the guy Duke's who literally finishes 8th and ninth. <laughs> Duke has wing damage. Oh, my God. Duke is Ooh. selling. Boo, Boog is having issues. That's what he's having right now. Now he's last. Well, Drew, you're P, you're P7 now, so. Yes. Well, as they're sorting out invites and stuff. Right now, good, uh, good job, good decent start to the race. A lot of chaos already, um, going on. I'm I mean, cold. this is about to be probably one of the chaotic races of the season now with all the rain pouring. Yep. So, already bad start for Boog, though. But if he gets an actual safety car, as VSC looks still like it's out here. You can't join still? So, let's see what can happen. I'll just, yep, I'll just count you wherever you finish, unless you win. It's right now, we're still in our VSC. This is. I don't know why it's taking so long right now. There we go. VSC has been we'll lifted. Just Somebody got a penalty. Somebody just got a penalty. It was my name is. Probably for. I don't know. Well, my my stream link is in the UPS chat. They're going green. Cali's already five tenths, four tenths. Yeah, five. Yeah. Good job by Cali, you know, reeling in under that VSC. I mean, it uh, looks like my name's John was maybe the one with that time penalty. Yep. It looked like so. Let's just see what happens. Um, oh, no. Bad Top seasons, spun. Wendy Goop. Saved it. Top sh wow. What a save by Top Shelf. As let's go on board uh, with the leader here. Uh, or actually, let's go on board with Cali here. As he's right now right behind Chan. Oh, my God. A good bow for second. He don't spun it. Chan called his number. He said he was going to win today, so I want to see if that's true or not. He better. Yeah, I he mean, can't be talking that much smack if you don't back it up. I mean, he's now got a second. Four. Cali had a horrible uh, sector, too. Yeah, but you know, one tiny mistake and you're basically done. Yeah, it is very rain. It's very slick. And Groan is on this speed up for third. He's basically we got him on the straight. Whenever my DRS doesn't exist. Yeah, but ERS and Slipstream still does a Shan just right in the fastest lap of the race. Oh Grown has a huge run. He goes a huge run oh to the God. outside he and he Oh Despacito let him by. Basically. I think it's a smart move. You know, letting people buy early on. It's way too early to battle, especially on a track where it's raining right now. A lot of mistakes can happen. So, okay. good job though. Let's go ahead. I'm gonna look at chat real quick. Uh, dude, just just come back and like uh, I don't know. Bad seasons, Wendy Goop. Wendy Goop, season six. That's death tragedy. No tire grip. Says top shelf. Top shelf says there's no tire grip out there. I, mean, I can tell he's running tenth. Yeah, he is running tenth right now. Shout out to the nine people that are watching us right now. Nine? It's quite a nine bit. Nine viewers here tonight. Remember, Joel this is a double header. Yeah. So this is not the only race. So right now we're looking at Despacito. Let's see. Uh, right now the next battle. It's us for fifth. We for fifth. Yeah. yeah. Kyle Butch fan and uh, very, Jonah. Two very aggressive drivers. Yeah, two very aggressive drivers. I would not be surprised if one of them spins out. Or both. Right here, I mean. Oh my god, Kyle Bush is down control. 
Mm-hmm. MC is already caught up. And MC's in eighth now. Yep, he just made the pass on Drew's AI. That, that's that's a very entertaining Drew. battle. Anders yellow flags. Uh, my name is John. Mm -hmm. Yep. I think you'll get him. My name's here. John. Has not had a good season. <laughs> He's only ran like one race. Oh my God! What a pass! Well, a couple of races. MC seven. MC's gonna win. Mm -hmm. I don't know. That's my prediction. I don't know. Let's see. Is interval to the leader? Oh, quite a bit. It's sixteen seconds. Yeah. It's MC though. Yeah, it's MC. He can probably make that up, but you do gotta remember, Jan did say he was gonna dump MC. Oh, he's been and he still hasn't gotten. He's been saying to. that for a couple races. I've been waiting. Well, the thing is, MC hasn't shown up in a little bit. I mean, yeah, yeah, he probably had a chance to dump him at Spa and didn't. Well, Chan just likes stalking and doesn't like doing. And oh, yeah, it's MC spawn, I think. And who spawn? I don't, I don't know. See, I think it was Jonah. Oh no! Looks like Jonah. Maybe Jonah? Cause he lost four seconds. On oh him. yeah, he lost. Yeah, he lost a couple seconds. So yeah, it was Jonah. Everything kind of spread out right now. Groan's about wrecked. That's, yeah, Gro Groan's got uh, about eight eight tenths of a second on uh, Despacito right now. Yeah. So, his tires don't matter. Stops, uh, penalties. Nobody's got penalty right now. So. MC's already Let's leave it at the intervals. MC went from 16.6 .6 to 16.1 already. 16.0 now. It's right now. No battles right now. Everybody's kind of spread out. Doing their thing. Speak. Yeah, they're all just doing their thing right now. Is today from Brazil. Um, no safety cars so far. We've had a couple of virtuals um, to start off this race. So. Uh, all right, two virtuals, two DNFs. Let's just see what happens here. Is right now Chan looking to see if he can extend his second place uh, on the uh, UPS all-time wins list. I mean, if Ground starts, Charlie so Peak could probably take it, or Despacito, or Edmund maybe. Well, yeah, he did pass Despacito sometime last season. And Ground for a uh, second, so. Oh yeah, it's not. It's not impossible. I mean, well, it's a pretty good chance. Maybe he could catch me. Something like 15 wins. Let's see. Biggest movers. Uh, Cali has gone from ninth to second. Groan has gone from 15th oh to third. Oh, my God. Just Jonah's about to spin. To fourth. And Thank you. Six. Oh. Tops up to the MC6. This man's making his way through the field. as three seconds to top shelf. Oh, he's out of control. Oh, top shelf's yeah. a lot of spin every corner. It is very difficult in the rain. You do got to say here in this game. I mean, you already got curbs that are going to wreck you if you hit if you don't hit them right. I mean, the rain's just another uh, inevitable, you know. So it is is it's going to be difficult, right? Especially much more difficult in the rain. You're racing the racetrack. It's kind of like what are you doing at I in the NASCAR? You're racing the racetrack, not the drivers. Yeah. You gotta race the racetrack. So right now we're looking at MC in sixth. See as we go through Sully, uh, you know, Sully's heading about twelfth right now. Boog's in eleventh after having a good qualifying effort. Just haven't had a good start to the race. Yep. MC's not really gaining much, and it's fifteen point nine. Yeah, it's currently dead even. Yep. Uh, right now I think I'm pace. Well, one mistake, yeah, there is your leader. You're done. 121. Yeah, one mistake, five. it's all it takes. One Cali was three tenths faster that lap. Grown was a tenth slower. And this Cedar was, I don't know. The TMC's lap. Some, driver, some drivers are saying there should be a MC. vote to call the race due to lightning and heavy rain. Deal with <laughs> says it. Says says Wendy Goop. Deal with it. <laughs> Deal with it. <laughs> God. Oh, MC ran half a second faster than Jam. Six cents, I think. And I think Indeed, someone spawned. I think, no, Jonah Pip. See, I don't see a caution. Boo, Boo with the fast slap, though. Hey, yeah. Boo's only 30 seconds behind. Don't count him out. <laughs> Top shelf is absolutely out of control. Oh, my God. I think some of these guys are going to need safety cars. That they really want to catch, I mean. Yeah. I mean, safety car. We've had two virtuals. Have had this, the big, yeah, we the haven't big had one. full safety car though. 
But, so, hey, that gap is going down. It's 2.1 now for the lead. Two seconds now. Yep. What would Chan do for a win? You know, Chan's been winless this season. He's had a couple of shots like Emila. Well, you know. he dove by you and Emila, so yeah. I, I think um, he'll do, do quite a bit. I think for he'll a win. do a lot. Oh, that's, yep, he's catching. Wow, one nineteen nine zero one. I mean, there's also a reason after Emo that Chan didn't finish Monaco. That's all I'm gonna say. Here's the reason he didn't finish Monaco. Oh yeah, I, we all oh, we all know the reason. <laughs> <laughs> Cause that was we all, I think we saw it on stream too. Yeah, I was I like, we all know seconds, the reason. <laughs> like ten laps behind, he was really frustrating me. So then I just punted him. Oh, Boogfax left. And one nineteen seven five three. I think we'll do a double header as long as we get eight. Cause I know some people are gonna leave. That's fine though. Yeah. So like I said, we do got Austria. That's, That's the three. cutoff for the for the regular season. It's not really a close so battle because the Wendy Goop DNF and Top Self's not running good at all. So I don't think it'll really be a battle. Top Self needs to get on that car and start pushing it to the top five. Yeah, it's right now. It's not looking good. Let's go ahead and look at some telemetry and lab data right now as we're looking at uh Cali, good job with the battery. About in the 40s to 50s. I mean, good Chan job keeping it charged Chan up. Chan has no battery. He's at 16. <laughs> yeah, he's running out of batteries. That's how I think MC, not MC, uh, Eben won uh, Japan, really, was because he had more battery than Wendy Goop. I think oh, Wendy, Wendy Goop, Goop, even though he, Wendy Goop spawn. did make a mistake. Yeah, he did make a mistake. But I feel like Wendy Goop would have had a chance to come back from his mistake if he had more ERS. I mean, I, Evan I think had... if Wendy Goop didn't spin, he would have won. Because you know how Wendy Goop is sometimes when it comes to racing people for wins. Yeah. He'll just take them out, for example, live. Yeah, yeah it's right now. You know, actually, that Well, race... I feel like that's been Chan this season, though. Yeah. Hey, before him out, that race that Wendy Goop won, that was technically the 100th UPS race. So I could have won the 100th race, but Wendy Goop said nah. Yeah, speaking of Vive, we haven't seen him in a hot no, minute. He's done. I don't, um, he just doesn't league race anymore. Like nothing. Yeah, he doesn't league race anymore. Well, I, I would imagine why he doesn't league race anymore. Caution Sector 1, it looks like an John Alfa Romeo virtual, virtual yeah. safety car. This could really Nobody help. Nobody DNF'd. I think there's too much debris. He has no win. That's why. Yeah, no. Too much debris. There's... Yeah, that's going to bring out the safety car, definitely, indeed. Virtually. Looks like he spun somewhere in three. So I would be careful going through here. Don't hit any wing, anything wings on the track. Oh, Chan, Chan slowed down majorly. I don't know what the delta is, but it's within six tenths right now. Rain will begin at 3.32 p.m. Okay, for the next few hours. Oh, my God. Okay. Oh, now Cali had to slow down. I guess oh, that's uh, not good. Cali got four red and Chan was running at the Delta. Yeah. Remember, skill. Cali can find a way to run that Delta, and Chan just has an issue under virtual. I think it would help out. Because right now, the way it looks, Cali would actually lose time right now. He would actually almost lose a second, maybe about he, five, ten. It got closer, man. Yeah, I got closer. This is going to be a battle under virtual. Now it's green. There we 1. go. Virtual. 7. Like it's yeah, the about same. basically stayed the same. One tenth oh, maybe. What happened? <laughs> For the record, Wendy Goop and Top Shelf did make contact on lap four. Wendy Goop sustained heavy wing damage, which and eventually led to his tragic DNF. <laughs> very tragic. <laughs> says, uh, says Wendy Goop. But yeah, two seconds now is uh, that's the gap to the lead. Uh, let's see, my name is John's in the pit road, getting a wing replacement for like the twentieth time. <laughs> yep, there's Sully trying his best in the Mercedes tonight. I mean, you know, Sully's trying his best out there. I can't really blame him for his twelfth right here. Jonah in eleventh, not a good run for Jonah. At all. Drew's AI is in tenth. Top shelf nine. Top shelf in ninth. Um, 
Not good yeah, when you need to make the playoffs. Yeah, he needs some. He needs a safety car if he wants to gain any more spots. I mean, he's got Jake in front of him. Jake's actually having a pretty good race in eighth right now. I mean, he's solidly running in there. I mean, yeah, it's been a good race for him. Boots Yellow flag. In seven. John again. I think. Yep. John again. Yeah, problems for John. There's MC in six. He's ran down Kyle Busch fan. So this is going to be a battle for the fifth spot right here. There's Kyle Busch in fifth. Despacito in fourth. Once again, he's uh, he's running these races because he's got some time off now. Well, so he's going like to be able January. to run these races. Like next yeah, until January. Two weeks, yeah. probably. Yeah. So Despacito could extend and probably maybe get some more wins here. Maybe take back second for a short period of time in the all-time wins list. But currently in fourth, it's been a good return for him, though. He's finished, I think, at least top five in his three starts. He's I been think back, so. seventh and third. I think he's under his watch. Seventh and third. So he's, this is his third race. Yeah so, yeah, so this is his third. Fourth place is pretty good. Groans. AKCB's returning oh. back. has got another top caution. Shelf. It looks like a top shelf. These Red Bulls are really not helping the constructors today. I'll say that much. Yep, his top shelf is now back to where Jonah could strike. Um, but CB, former champion, making his return. His uh, He made one race last season that was... Uh, France. Abu Dhabi and France. Oh, Abu Dhabi and France. Yeah. Okay. So he's made he made two starts last season. Abu Dhabi and France. France. He was contending. Uh, but you know what happened? Yeah. Yeah. We all know what happened. Eben is still not happy about that day. What happened at France? Yeah. I, I'm happy I about mean, what happened. I'm pretty content. Oh, top shelf down pit road. Top shelf. He's screwed. <laughs> he's gonna go left down. He's yep. a he's and a minute then, uh, and a ten. Minute. Yep, is now we are looking at um I think Cali. You have Cali. To one shop, at least. Yeah, it's a one because it's on wets. I mean, wets uh, last very long in the rain conditions. But... but I don't know. It looks a little more less. Looks a little more dry, like inners. Yeah, I see drizzle right now. I mean. Oh, I think my name is John Inners. So. Oh, and top shelf spun again. Top shelf is out of the race. Oh, will that be a safety car? I doubt it. He's like completely nowhere. Yep. Virtual. What is with these virtuals? Yeah, four virtuals today. Oh, safety car. It's oh. graduated to a full-on safety car. Okay. So this changes everything. I mean, everybody's going to be a lot more closer now. Do they pit for enders? I don't know. I don't know if they, they've recommended enters. I mean, it's, well, we still, no it's like raining... But it's not pouring. I mean, it's not pouring, but it's still raining out there. I mean. Yeah. It just depends what you want to do. Yes. There's a uh, Chan. Well, while you're under virtual, we're not doing anything. Top Shelf says, F this track with the rain. No <laughs> grip. I give up. <laughs> I have a question. Oh, eat that. That what, messes you up. We can do tomorrow nothing or what? What? You're not going to do anything tomorrow for Christmas Eve? Well, I ha oh, I gotta go to my dad's tomorrow. I'm gonna mm. go. My dad wants to take me and see some cousins tomorrow. We're not racing for about tomorrow. a couple hours. And well, that, we're done for the week. We're done for the week until next week. Oh, okay. Chan tried so to no fake race. him out. <laughs> oh wow, he almost hit the pit, the end of the pit wall. I thought he was, I thought he was gonna crash. Next, I mean, next week is probably Monday or Tuesday. Yep, it's five second time penalty for Grove. They went in enters. They went in the pit enters. Lane. Okay, enters. Interesting strategy. Do they all go? So strategy use? taking place. That's the main question. Thing is, it enters the good call though. I don't. I think it might be. It looks way less dry. Yeah, everybody's going on enters. The only ones that are not are Boog and Ro Drew Rock. So they haven't They've can't come on pit road. Yeah, they haven't come on pit road yet. Oh, Jonah. not Boog's in. He took his enters. Drew's not pitting. So I don't. Wait, wait. Penalty. Well, you also got to remember Drew's AI. I mean, yeah, but oh, Grown think... got a five. Yeah, that's for speeding in pit lane. That's an L for him. He... Yeah, a big L because now he's going to be five seconds back between everybody. Oh, good. Lagged top out. shelf first half. <laughs> good. 
Oh, yeah, if he lagged out, somebody might need to invite him back. Well, I'm the league on this, so I'll just do it myself. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and invite Top Shelf for interview. Another, uh, uh, what's it called that they do in NASCAR? Where they wreck out? The infield care uh, center? Yeah, from the infield care center. If top shelf, top to the shelf. Elf on the shelf. Here, let me in. Um, I want to see this. Okay. There we go. Okay, there we go. I don't know. Next season, I still haven't decided if I'm wrong. I'll think about it. Okay. So there we go. There it's Top Shelf. Caesar, you are with Top Shelf now from the Enfield Care Center. Uh, so, what happened Top Shelf today? Um, I was just struggling for grip the entire, basically the entire run after that lap one crash. Um, I'm at downhill it. from the S's. I basically had to drift that corner three times because of lack of grip. Girl, got another five. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so Top Shelf, uh, what do you think you, you could do at Austria since, you know, your playoff hosts are basically over. You, you, you yeah. can still make. There's 11 races left in the season. What do you think you could do for us the last 11 races? Well, um, basically go out there, have some fun now, because you know, playoffs are out the window. Just like how Buffalo Bills used to back in like the early 2000s, but we're not going to talk about it. I'm aiming for a podium. I don't care anymore. I mean, it's I need possible. Redemption. I mean, you you don't got the pressure anymore trying to make the playoffs. So yeah, you could be way more aggressive. Just just don't kill anyone. Okay. So yeah. Uh, what do you think? What's the plan for the rest of the season? Just go all out and try to get a podium or win? Yeah, that's that's been the, basically the strategy since day one until I got in the play, in the playoff hunt. Uh, okay, top shelf. Uh, 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 not a great race, but you, are you gonna uh, you could wrap you could rebound at Austria, so you can see what yep. you can do there. All right. And good luck at Austria. Thank you. Yep. You ace that. You absolutely aced the interview. I just asked the most random generic questions that they asked, like, in real life. I know they work. Well, I guess we have top stuff oh. in the race. Oh, sure, so you could probably do something there. Yep, because right now we're going one more lap around. Safety car is not announced he's coming in this time. Then so. Grunk could pit and serve the, the five. Yeah, serve the five second. Yeah, Grunk's... Oh, well, you got to make sure you slow down this time, Groan. I mean... You've done it twice. He's... Yeah, let's see. Third yeah. time's a charm. I mean, just go... Why is he going this quick? He did it again, huh? No, he didn't. No, okay. <laughs> he didn't do it this time. And Juzay, I'm okay. kidding, so that means it's for sure ready. Yeah, so it's for sure ready. Oh, here we go. And there, he's got to serve the five, and... That's hilarious. He sped on pair uh, what now twice? <laughs> Wait, he sped again or no? Oh well, he sped twice. He sped yeah. in coming uh, around the pit before everybody got to the safety car, and then a second time under safety car. You know what virtual really does to this race? It brings what? MC and Boo back in it. <laughs> it does. Watch the map. I mean, it really does. Because I'm looking at fastest laps. Both of them are th four tenths faster than Chen and Kelly. Yeah, Boog's got the fast lap, 119.544, uh, I and mean. And then, and he's a 10th off, then after that, it's Kelly who's 3 tenths off. Chan doesn't really look that quick. I think Chan just being very smart. Yeah, very small, a smart facing, <laughs> facing himself right now, as Wendy Goop says, for top shelf to get into the playoffs in Austria, he would have to give at least second with fastest lap and... And me score no points. If Top Shelf got second without fastest lap, it would be a tie, which I would win the tiebreaker due to win. No, According he, no. To... There's no fastest lap point. Top Shelf has to win Austria. <laughs> well, putting, uh, gotta put the pressure on Top Shelf. I mean, I mean, even if he doesn't make the playoffs, it's been a way better season than he's done before because usually Top Shelf is usually a meme running in the oh, back. Oh, God, they're stacking. Not really. Oh. Oh, oh, my name is John with a grid or time penalty. Somebody stacked up Jake the pack. Got five. We are back under green. Safety car has been lifted. Here we go. Despacito making a move into one. And he made it stick. Or no, he did not. Oh, no. Callie had the advantage right there. MC goes to the top. Run from Cali. Oh, my God. Oh, this MC. is not going to be good. Contact. Oh, oh. 
This is about to be tight, folks. Kyle break him. Oh my god, Kyle Busch break him. Oh yeah, Kyle Bo Oh, but he's gonna get the ball run. Spins. Oh, he gets loose. He breaks he the spins. whole wing. The whole wing is off. The whole thing. Oh, what tragic. Up? That puts Gaming Jake to six. How tragic Boob must that be fifth. for them to see that? He just wasn't patient enough, and he now his race is over. I think he went wide and just got on that rumble strip. I mean, I think that's what may have just spun him out. I mean, it's wet, the, rub, the curbs, and the rumble strips are just not good. I mean, in other words, his race is over. <laughs> yep, is there is the intervals? Chan's already back to his second lead. Boog. Boog looking for a. Uh... Oh my God. Oh, Kyle Busch gets loose. Boog's going to take advantage. Boog the fourth. Hey, McLaren's last in constructors. They got third and fourth right now. Oh my God, Kyle. Busch. Oh, Kyle Busch ran. Oh, Chan just. Chan passes lap. Chan set out them quick laps because Boog is coming. He's in fourth. Boog. Ain't. Boog ain't no slouch. Yeah, Boog is not no slouch. I mean, Despacito behind Cali. He's got about 2.4 second lead on Cali. Cali's got about one second. Advantage over Despacito, and then Despacito's got less than one second over Boog. So you got about maybe four cars with a shot. As Top Shelf says, I'm going all out. Give it my best shot. Go, Jake. MC pull the Top Shelf. Says <laughs> <laughs> Top Shelf. And my name is John. And gets another three seconds. That's so. Oh my God! How many? How many pen penalties will this man have? Oh, as as many. He's taking as many L's as Shan has this season. Ooh. Watch you say that Chan wins this race now all of a sudden. Nah, I don't care. I mean, it doesn't matter to me, to be honest. <laughs> I'm very unfazed when it comes to you know, people talking. You just go out there and do my thing. Okay, so update. Top Shelf must win Austria, <laughs> and me get no points, says um, Money Goop, or... Him gets second, and me gets seventh or lower. No, him. I think he did it the other way. Oh, Boog just ran fast lap. Yeah, fast as lap. You gotta give Boog some time. I mean, Boog, Boog takes a little bit. You know, he doesn't get the first lap to get going. It takes him multiple, multiple Hey, but that laps. lap was four I mean, times quicker. Yeah, and he's going to be coming, too. And I think my dad's here. I'm going to call him. There's Desposito. There's, there's Cali. There's Despacito. He's got Boog right on his tail. You might let him by. This is like grown by earlier. Yeah, you let grown by. Grown was faster. Here comes Boog. Just really gonna see that where is Despacito gonna let him by. No, where's he gonna pass him? I don't, I don't know if he let him by. Yeah. Maybe because they're really McLaren. Passing yeses. Maybe because they're McLarens. That you might let him by. Yeah. I mean. We all remember what happened at uh, Imola, uh, not Imola, but um, Monza in real life, right? <laughs> yep. Don't don't go for Ricardo. <laughs> I think if Boog wins, big run. I need to ask him what driver he chose because I need to make the podium at it, or whatever it's called. Well, here we go, big run outside. Yep, he breaks. He breaks. Yep, and let him by. Boog on podium. I think Despacito's thinking that maybe they wreck each other. He could just sneak out the win. Yeah, but he's got to get past Cali. Cali's getting a little bit on Chan right now. Boog looks like the fastest guy on the racetrack right now, though, in third. And he is coming. Well, C might be the fastest guy on the racetrack, but he's 42 seconds behind the leaders. I mean, he made his own mistake. I mean, that's on him. Yeah, I can't blame Purple Kyle Sector Bush, won from Boog. I can't blame Kyle Busch for that. He didn't do anything wrong. Yeah. He gave him the space and he just ran out of talent. Is that here? Do that. Here we go. Is once again ERS decent amount of ERS though. Twenty to thirties, you know, it's a very low number, but it's still very decent. I'll be right back. Is Caesar will be right back. Is here we go. I'm bored with Boog. Oh, he is making time. He just had a fastest sector, too. Oh, my God. This man might run fastest lap again. And he's got a big run on Cali. Big run. 
fastest lap, 116.728. What a lap from the McLaren. McLaren's looking to see if they can get the dub. They haven't gotten a win this season. They've had a rotation of drivers in the lineup. And this season, Who? it looks like they could possibly get a win. They had one win last season. It was definitely because of Jonah at Abu Dhabi. Oh, McLaren? Other than that, McLaren did not have a win the rest of that rest of last season. This season, winless is McLaren. Hey, McLaren Looking and Mercedes still have a win this season. Everyone, every other constructor does. Well, this could be a battle to see which constructor is going to have the going to be the last wins because honestly, if I'm Kelly, I let I let I let because then they could probably like, yeah. Oh, caution sector two. Somebody has an issue. I just have a son. Just saying. Oh, we could have dry racetrack. I mean, that'll change everything. Oh, it's really DRS. Boo's going to have a big run on Cali, though. DRS might be working now. No, it's not. Here we go. Big run. Slipstream and ERS. Big run on Cali. To the outside. Just Can he outbreak? He might be able to. Uh, he did. Oh, I think Cali he can fought. easily go. Oh, he's going to have the preferred line here, too. He's oh, a little contact. A little contact. Oh, more to... He's not, they're not touching tires. Yeah, he got him. He got him. Boog the second. This Pacito's back in this. Boog's out here about to get the spin and win here if he keeps on with this run. You know, Chance not very happy because he's felt like he's d deserved to win. And here comes Boog out of nowhere to take it away from him. Chan says if, Chan, I just got a report. Chan says if I win this race, I qualify on wets for Austria. <laughs> He's not going to win those, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> uh, about 13 laps remaining. 20, I'm just going off on chain. Purple stuff. There's the too. penalties for the race. 14 seconds worth of penalties for my name is John. I mean. It doesn't matter anyway. He's running fast. Yeah. Very bad. Sniper Rapper says oof. Top Shelf says invite me to uh, party Aiden. So he's talking the uh, Wendy Goop. Oh, yep. Yeah, no, uh, he's, he's really catching him. Oh, yeah, he is reeling them in. I mean, you know, absolutely reeling them in. But you know who we're talking about? Chan. Chan's not going to let him have. Chan, once again, defending series champion, has struggled to find a win this season. He says a lot in his interviews. He's had the pace to win. It's just he hasn't had the luck to win. And he's open today will be the day he can get the luck to get the win this season. But Boog is here. We're already at race 15 as Boog has ran him down. I mean, it was almost three seconds, two laps ago. It's 1.6. I mean, Boog has got to be one of the best rain racers here. I mean, this man has been lightning fast I think on rain races. The fastest car on tracks MC, but once again, he's choked, him, he's choked his race away. Do you guys say, do you guys shout out uh, Jonah making a comeback after a huge spin? Up now in sixth. Oh, purple um, sector too. Oh, here we go. He's almost less than a second already. Yep, here we go. 11 laps remaining in the Brazilian Grand Prix. Fast lap. Nope. Close. No. Very close. Very close. What? It's less than a second now. Now he's got it. The question is, oh, he is flying. The question is, how hard what will Chan do? Wreck him, <laughs> probably. Wreck him. <laughs> there might be, we might be having some fist flying after this race. You, I mean, if that happens, you know, it's funny though. I picked Boot from him in chat today because he wasn't racing, and now he just pulls up and races. Well, here we go. Six tenths. Chance, Chance said a cause of SC sore loser. So Chan's already uh, finding excuses, I guess. And screw him, <laughs> said uh, Chan. I guess Chan also said screw him. Um, here we go, Boog. They both have very similar battery. Oh, but it, it looks like he's just faster off just pace. It ain't battery at this point. It's just pace. Oh, he's got him. Chan's going to have to throw a very stupid block. Yeah, he will. Here we go. 
Big run from McLaren. Down the front straightaway. He's got slip scream. See, he's blocking the outside. Inside. Oh, he's going to give him the outside here. Bow for lead. Oh, I don't think Chan's going to give him much room. Yep, did not. He goes wide. He's still going to hold on to the lead. If they keep on battling, I guess Cal leads him to catch up. And Cali would get and a, a huge. And Grown got three seconds. Hey, it stopped the rain. Oh, it stopped the rain. Oh, we could go on dry soon. This could be huge. The strategy. Chan might have to put strategy to win this race. That's the only way I see it. Thing is, can the track stay wet for about 10 laps? Maybe you don't have to pit. Nah, oh, no. he's looking to John's the outside. On softs. And he's also served five seconds. Oh, Chan cut him off. Are you surprised, though? <laughs> Boo Boog had the outside. Chan just cut him off. Are you surprised, though? <laughs> no, I, I guess I say I shouldn't be, but... <laughs> oh, Boog got Here loose. we go. This might be another good run, maybe, even though he got loose. He's got DRS. He's got Slipstream. ERS. Chen's pulling. Oh, well, yeah, ERS. Yeah, he's pulling. It's because he got loose. I feel like getting loose right there from uh, Boog really, really hurt him right there. Chen got loose again. I mean, Chen got loose. Oh, big run. Jonah, five seconds for speeding on pit lane. Here we go. McLaren with a run. Not Will he close make a enough. Move? Jonah pitted for Not close. This is now about to get interesting, folks. Oh, they're out pitting for Sauce. MC's in. I meant. Oh, no. He might be in, though. Let's see. So we head through the. Uh, I like to call. I don't know. What do you really call these? <laughs> what? The S's? I call them S's. That's what I do. Yeah, the S's. Yeah. Oh, Chang got super loose. I mean. Side oh, side. yeah, here we go. Oh, he tried to cut him off again. Almost squeezed him to the grass. No, if Chan keeps on doing that, he ain't going to finish this race. That's all I'm going to say. Oh, and uh, at Caution uh, Sector Jake? 2, it looks J like Jonah or uh, the, Jake. The, the, I think it's Jonah. Oh, the, the softs it's aren't Jonah. ready. Jonah, yeah, softs are not ready. He went for the big move. Oh, he's going to have a huge run. Here we go. Huge run. He to cut the him outside. Oh, Chan blocks him. No, nah, nah, you can't. Aggressive block. You can't cut him. If, if, if he cuts him off one more time, Boog is not. Uh, Jonah wrecked out. Jonah wrecked out. Will that bring out a safety car? I think he might have paused it. Yeah, he paused it. Oh, he paused retired. Big run from Boog. Oh, now oh <laughs> Chan cuts him off. Pass in the grass. Boog to the lead. Chan. Oh, Boog takes out Chan. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Chan's got heavy wing damage. I guess cause I guess that's the return favor of shot blocking him twenty times. <laughs> I mean he did cut him off a bunch of times. I do gotta say, Brendan says this is fun to watch. And Top shell says Chan sold. <laughs> I mean it's true. He cut him off way too many and times. That, I would have done the same thing. As a driver, you know. There there comes to a limit how many times you can cut someone off. And Chan definitely is, passed yeah. it. You can definitely see Chan is... Oh, Chan gets loose. He's in the grass. He's done. Good for softs. Yeah, Go for is. it. So we have seen the softs are not ready. I think they might be ready Right now. now. The surface just looks ready. Or very close. Here. There's Boog. There's Cali. Despacito's on podium as we speak. Oh, Despacito's pitting. Softs. The seal's pitting. It's going to be huge. They're, be they're gambling like it's Las Vegas. He's going soft. See what he takes. Soft. Soft. He's gambling like it's Las Vegas. I mean, when you're behind, I think he's only was behind Cali by at least maybe like two tenths. So. Oh, it's an able. This is a DRS. He oh, my. He might have. Oh, Despacio it. could steal the show. He, I think he can steal a spot off Cali. It just depends how his lap is going to be here he on his out lap. It. He's using all your rest. Yeah. Yeah, it's going to have to depend on the out lap. He's 24 seconds behind. Just keep that in mind to see how quickly it drops. Oh, he spun it. Yeah. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> Never mind, so anticlimactic. He spun it off the same corner Jonah did. <laughs> Chan, <laughs> Top Shelf says Chan is so mad he blames me for uh, what a loser. Chan should hold this L. <laughs> I mean, it's Top true. Shelf. Boog doesn't pit. This Callie has to pit. Oh, Boog did Callie not didn't pit. pit. Callie, Callie didn't pit. KB fan, go for it. That's what I say, or Chan. Uh, he's about eight seconds behind KB's, Callie. KB's he's going for it. And Chan. Chan. Chan's going for it. Kyle Bush fan, five seconds. CB, five seconds for speeding. I mean. Oh, so they blew the chance. Yeah, they blew the chance. Yeah. Chan's not going to have a chance. He's got to repair a wing. I mean. Yeah, there he goes. Wing onto their car. Top Shelf is easily one of the least talented drivers in the league. Who said that? Wendy Goop. Wendy Goop. No wonder he is probably getting sacked. Cali should have pitted. Cali should have pitted. Hey, Jake's on yeah, the podium. should have pitted. Jake's gaming on the podium. Jake, hey. Hey, I would say I, I do like a gaming Jake podium. I, I mean, doubt it will happen because he's on those old ass. I engines. doubt it, but, you know. You know, there, there's this one thing you can't be mad at in life, and it's a Wendy Goop podium. Or not Wendy Goop, Jake. but it's a Gaming Jake podium. Yeah, Gaming Jake podium is one thing you can never be mad at. No, Cali looks like he'll be the only challenge. Ooh, Top Shelf says, say, uh, says the one who got dropped by Red Bull. Boog did a pit. Cali's in. Oh, my God. Oh, God. What is Boog doing? Like it's, I don't the, know. The, the surface is so dry now. Like you gotta be stupid. Is he to is he playing just trying to hold on for nah. how many laps to go there? There's is? five I mean, to go, and those tires will be 15 seconds faster a lap. I mean, just look at that. Sully with fastest lap. Hey, hey, Sully fastest lap. Cali yeah. gambled. <laughs> I mean, boot back gambled. Let's see what the gap is now between him and KV. 21 seconds. Not, he's in a good KV. 21 seconds. He's 21. easily going to get out in front of KV, yeah. Easily in front of Boog if he just doesn't pull a disposito and wreck the car. Yeah, let's see. Let's see how much he's going to gain here. Already three tenths, four tenths, five tenths. <laughs> Off one corner. Last time I checked, Chan is a champion and Top Shelf can't even get a podium. Insane <sighs> that Top Shelf is going after him, says Wendy Goop. Wendy Goop also says, I forced Chris to drop me. I'll send you a screenshot, bud. God. Okay, because he's on. Trash talking in the chat. Two seconds already. Two seconds, Boog. Is he going to pit this time? He has to. Yeah, he has to. Yeah, he's going to. Smart decision. Oh! What? Oh, that was lag. That was lag. I thought he pounded the wall. Okay. I thought he pounded the wall. Caddy's on a purple lap. <laughs> Let's see, we're gonna go on board with Cali, see where he winds up out as it's another car close. comes down pit road. And Boog on softs. Cali easily gonna get him, I think. No, it's not. Oh. He got him. See? Stri yeah, he easily got him. Two seconds. But he's got one lap fresh of tires. Wow. One lap. He's got a lot fresher. And grown he's spun. got four laps. Grown spun. Grown spun, not a return. Grown as wanted today. MC fastest lap 111, 546. Four to go. Fastest lap Two of the race. Five seconds. I feel like Boots faster, but this guy. Cali could steal. Could get a good win here today. He was. He's been very good this race. I mean, top three for most of, oh, for all race long. I mean, Jake's very still good on job, answers. but. Jake is probably just hoping. I mean, he's hoping like a thunderstorm nothing. passes by right now. Yeah. Oh my God. Imagine it just pour heavy pours again, like right now, and Jake, Jake takes would win. the win because he's not it. Doubt it'll happen. Oh. I doubt, but imagine oh. that would be hilarious. Oh, Cali fast lap. John, Cali fast John lap. One ten nine eight nine. But hey, John Rex. Who gained six tenths that lap? Oh, yeah, he's around. Bo yeah, Boog did gain six tenths. Now two tenths. This could be down. This could be a last lap send for the win. Hey, I'll, you'll, If you can think about it. That'll be the seventh one of the season. Yes, it will be. His MC, 110, 771. 
He's putting up. Top Shelf says, I, I want to win. Uh, <laughs> Wendy Goop goes, multiple people are saying that not going to happen. Sorry, buddy. Top <laughs> Shelf says, who cares what they say? They can they can suck it. <laughs> but take a oh ten minute God. break after this race. Yeah, ten minute break after this race. I might comment on this. Yeah. Let's here we go. Three times coming to two laps remaining. Guess what happened? John spun oh. again. Oh God, this is this is about to be good. We could have another close finish today here, folks. I mean... Oh, my God. Seven tenths. Boog, 109601. What a lap from Boog. Qualifying laps, now. I mean, we're in that portion of the race. I mean... You're going to have to run fast. He's going to need DRS. Uh, he's got to get in DRS range by next lap, I think. No, that's... Even though he's putting he's down lap there. times... He's already there. Yeah, he's already... Yeah, less than a second. Can Cali hold on? I feel like he can. He just can't mess up. Can't mess up. But Boog just looks Chan so much cur faster. Currently, Chan currently looks like he's going to be in third because of the five-second penalty Kyle Busch fan has. I think Grown has five. Grown also has five, but he does have enough gap between him and MC where that five is not going to matter. Five, half a second. That's... Despacito in seventh. I think Despacito would be in third if he did not spin on his. I think it would be leading. Lap. Yeah, I actually think he would be leading over Cali. But here we go. Coming to the white flag. One more lap remaining Boom. in the Brazilian Grand Prix. Boo runs another fast lap. Oh, he's there. He's going to have DRS down to this straightaway right here. And he is there. Here we go. DRS and ERS time. Four tons. Big run from McLaren. Two. Oh, it's less than three tenths here. Oh, can Boog make it happen through the S's, though? I think Boog's oh, in the way to the straight. I mean, kind of hard to pass here. Here we go. Oh, God. This is about to be intense, folks. Here we go, through the second set of S's. They both have good ERS. Let's see. This is the last corner. If you want to make a dive bomb, he's going to get a good run. He's there. ERS, DRS, big run. A huge he's going to look. Kelly's going to block. He's got it. Side by side at the line. Boog got it. Boog's going to win. What a finish. <laughs> Oh my god. What a finish! That doesn't count. He'll get fourth. Wow. Bro, what so a... Kyle Bush fan gets podium? Are you counting his five seconds? No, or... the, it gave him another five. He just gets five. So he gets fourth. I think he's still finished fourth. Okay, well, yeah. Well, he does get fourth, yeah. What a finish. Chan will get third. What a finish! Haha, ha, Boog is gonna win. Callie once again. In a close finish. Well, well, this He's not going to grab the win. Second, oh, of course, Cali. Third will be Chan. Chan comes back after the damage. Um, the finish third. Kyle Bush fan with a solid P4. P5 for MC. Um, Groan's going to finish six. Despacito waiting at the start finish line for some. Oh, he's DNF'd at the start finish line. Oh, not even at the start finish line. Or maybe he's already passed it. I'm not sure. He's going to finish seventh. Drew Rocks. P8 today. Chance complaining that he got taken out when he threw like 20 Gaming stupid blocks. Gaming Jake P9. As he's crashing it. Sully 10th. And my name is John. P11. What a race. Okay. Uh, we'll start. Your boy Marcus says, wait, my penalty doesn't count. Brendan says, holy shit. Can you say it in chat? My PC has no audio as of current. <laughs> God. But that is going to be it for the first race of the doubleheader. Remember, stick around, folks. We got more races here for this doubleheader. Um, so you guys might want to stay around. We're going to do interviews with the top three. Yeah, interview And then them. we're going to go ahead. Invite them. Yeah, you can... 
You can get to say, yeah. I'm uh, I'm gonna invite him. You can interview second if you want. I'll get first and third. Oh yeah, you need to get chance. <laughs> I'll get Kelly. Okay. Okay. So I'm gonna let's see. Boog, Kelly, chance. So so technically, Grown got fifth, not six. Okay, so his five is not counting. No, it's because they add an extra five if you don't serve it. That's stupid. Okay. So he technically gets. You know. So he gets fifth. I think um KB I fan, think still fourth. fan gets fourth yeah. because he, he was not five more than five seconds ahead than of Chan. So Chan still gets third out of t- of the first race of this double header. What a race. What a finish too. I mean that was what an amazing finish. <laughs> I mean another photo finish here. Chan's not joining. Right now. Chan must be salty. He must be salty, yeah. I mean, are you surprised? No, he's not he's either. He doesn't think he's a podium. He does. Well, somebody's got to tell Chan he's a podium. <laughs> yeah, but no. Kelly got the the taste of his own medicine. Dude, if I only had any more URS on that, that's hey, so it's... unlucky. <laughs> You're second in points now, so. Yeah, I yeah. know. Oh, Did I run Austria or no? Uh, I don't care. I think, you, I think you should run Austria. Okay. I mean, it's the final regular season race. And I got I'll, it locked I'll up. I'll have somebody. <laughs> yeah. If they didn't have, have that little slip in up, for, bro. In race. Yeah. So we're back in the lobby. Somebody. Gotta, come on. Someone invite Canapolis No Dads. I'm going to go join the other party. Be right back. <laughs> okay, hold on. Wow. Also, somebody's got to get the finish of the um, of Bahrain too. You got can't nobody can forget about Bahrain. I mean, Bahrain was close too. Okay, somebody get Boog. Boog, why isn't okay? Why isn't Boog joined? Okay, I'm gonna invite Boog then again or again for like the third time. Ha <laughs> ha, Boog. That was fun. Dude, all it just there took was one more tenth on the lap before I had that. I'm gonna message him. Uh, I don't want to be, I don't want to be dirty and just throw him. I was like, I want to make this good. I don't like Chan. There we go. As um, so here we go. As we're gonna interview, uh, your winners here today, um, or your podium here for this race at least. Because remember, we do have the double header. So I'm going to be sitting here with third place finisher Chan here today, who's going to finish third uh, in the first race of this doubleheader. Chan, you got a copy there, buddy. Make sure your uh, mm-hmm. uh, your audio is included. Yeah. Well, what a um, what a uh, what a podium, man! You had a chance for the win. Something happened there. Tell us, you know, what a uh, what happened there from your Book point happened. of view that lost you the race. Book happened. I gave him the space. Came up, but it's whatever. This dumb shit. Dave even block him like once crazy. Again, once again, this rides um, like a dumbass. Falling ass. short. Uh, once again, uh, falling short of another win this season. Um, uh, you know, we're already about to head in the race 16. Defending champion has no wins. What do you got to say for that? Um, in your season so far. Just dumb. Should have won multiple races this year, but it's whatever. Wow, six in already. <laughs> um, and then um, you know, final race here, Austria. Before we head into the playoffs, is this race for you? Just the race where you can try and get a win at least to see if you can get some momentum going into the playoffs here. Yeah, we won last time we were here, so that's what I'm hoping for. Okay, well, congratulations on your podium, and uh, we wish you good luck for the second race coming up in a little bit. Mm-hmm. Okay, uh, Caesar, you're actually going to get Cali. Boog declined his interview, so you're here with Cali. No, you do it. I didn't make. Oh, problem. I do it. Okay. Yeah, uh, it's fine. Okay, well, uh, Cali, you there, buddy? You got yeah, a copy? I got you. What a second place today. Fall short of a. 
of a win. Uh, wow, what what did you need there on that last lap to see if you can capture that win? Apparently, I needed my car orange. Uh, <laughs> uh, I, I had a two and a half second lead with like three to go, and I was like, oh yeah, I know I'm gonna choke this, knowing me, because you know it's Cal it's Cali. He chokes everything he's in. But uh, if I only if only I had one more tenth on final lap, I'm gonna step up on like the second to last corner. That cost me about a tenth, and I think that tenth would have been the decider. So. Yeah, is it did, but good. Uh, another close finish for you. Um, you know, but you were at the bad end of this finish. Tell us, you know, uh, Austria coming up. You're definitely going to be in the playoffs. Tell us, you know, what what's going to what are you going to do at Austria? Are you going to pace yourself, try and build more momentum? Is you're already riding off a bunch of momentum after this race alone? But tell us, what what's going to be that plan in Austria? Oh, it's just to get another podium. Hopefully a win. Get revenge after today. Or just now, actually, because we're going into the next race. <clears throat> I got yeah, I got hand baby then... fed my medicine just now. <laughs> so. <laughs> well, um, and then tell us, you know, you, you know, playoffs, I definitely think you are guaranteed in. I think you are now a lock spot into the playoffs. Tell us, you know, Playoffs coming uh, coming up after Austria. What is going to be that mindset for you to have a shot at the title? I was just keeping up with Chris. I mean, you can't can't compete for the title with that unless you're competing with Chris. And he, he blew me out of the water at Portugal too. So gotta find something. Okay, well, congratulations on your second. We wish you uh, good luck for uh, Austria here coming up in probably a couple seconds. Yeah, we're about to go. Okay, is there about to go? I like to think. <laughs> no, uh, uh, yeah. I... There's a party. Yeah. Oh. Get in top shelf. I don't think tops. I don't buy it. I don't buy it. There it yeah, is right now. There we go. Um, we are go. This is Austria. This is the second race of the double header. It's going to be coming up. We're going to be doing one shot qualifying here. I'd like to thank Caesar for coming out commentating um, Brazil. Um, so thank you, to Caesar. Also, uh, congratulations, Cali, on second. Congratulations, to the Boog, on the win. He's going to see if he can go back to back and sweep today's doubleheader. I mean, it's going to definitely be interesting. And now, I get to pick my in race reporter. And I, I think the in race reporter today. I've already we've seen Cali. Um, in here, we've seen, uh, technically Caesar counts as kind of an in-race reporter as well, but he commented, yeah. He won his in-race reporter. Um, I'm about to make that decision right now. I'm going to invite them. I think I'm a race. Okay. Oh, I was hoping you would race. <laughs> so, so in-race reporter, he's been asking for this. He's been Top begging shelf. for it. I mean, I gotta do it. <laughs> Um, make a wish for him because yeah time to give out some uh making some people's wishes today <laughs> as there is All top right, shelf good luck as caesar's leaving top shelf you are my in-race reporter today for austria so all righty so there we go i mean at least i don't gotta hear chan in that so i'm all good <laughs> Well, that is good, so make sure your audio is included it is. here. Um, let's see, as, uh, Austria is going to be running here in a little bit. It is one-shot qualifying. Should be fun yeah. here today. Uh, this is double hundred. This is actually going to probably be now the longest streamed UPS race ever. Oh, really? Because now, because the double header, like all of our races have basically been an hour, yeah, like, hour and a half, maybe hour 15. I mean, exactly. W today, we're going to go almost in like the two, maybe three hour range <laughs> maybe. today. I mean, definitely going to be yeah. very well. It's, it's not going to pass as the longest stream I've ever right. done. I mean, I've done longer streams. <laughs> I've done, I've done five hour streams. I mean, that, th those take a long time. I think the most I've but, streamed for when I've ever streamed. Might have been like three or four hours, but it was like I've done five hours. Yeah, I did. Uh, I did a five-hour stream on um, Call of Duty Black Ops series. So I played like Black Ops One for an hour, Black Ops Two for an hour, 
Black Ops 3 for an hour, Black Ops 4 for an hour, and then Black Ops 5 for an hour. So, I've streamed for like hours on end. So <laughs> it's not like. Yeah, sorry if it sounds like. My dad like, called um... me. I got to call. I <laughs> called my dad back at the. the so real quick um so while i'm here tell us about austria and everything that might happen today here at austria well um we're probably gonna see chan try to kill me maybe wendy Goo try to kill me um fast circuit for sure um probably one of my favorite tracks because of all the speed um trying to think Lots of overtaking on straights. DRS zones everywhere almost basically. Expect to see lap times run at like 110, like maybe like 105 at least. You gotta be kidding me, it's frickin' rain. You love to see it. Rock them up in that corner. Okay, I'm back. Okay, I'm back. Yeah, this is hell. I'm back. Oh god, it is. I locked them up into that like um a hairpin corner. Uh, it is pouring in qualifying. I swear to God, if this turns well, out like Brazil, I'm dead. Well, here we go. You might your control if you're broken. <laughs> <laughs> well, sorry if it sounds like one into the yeah controller graveyard. Just so you know, sorry if it, if my voice here, is all here scratchy. Here we go for pole. Absolutely not Boog's me. Who's gonna get it? I mean, who wow. just like the Jesus of rain racing, dude? He is. I mean, he's the best rain racer I've seen. I'm like mid pack of mid of rain racer. Cause there we go. There's the lineup. Boom, oh, by the way, pole MC second. It might be one of them like transition like rain to dry. Rain to dry. Okay. Yeah. I'm expecting carnage turn one. Someone's gonna freaking yeah, Roman Grosjean on dive bomb first corner like it's freaking uh, Belgium. Yeah. Spec well, this is about to get into Spec see a flip. Flip. Like like Spider Man, do a flip. <laughs> Probably. Yeah, do a flip. But yeah, sorry that my voice is all scratchy. I'm actually sick right now. Oh, oh. 
but yeah, it's all good. Yeah. So, well, here we go. Go I'm about to go into the race. So I should hear a couple cuss well, words if I'm racing. Uh, yeah, as long as you, oh, know, you know the rules. Yeah, I know. I'll try to, you know, beat them out. Well, it's going yeah. to be, uh, dry. So basically, like, lap 20, it's going to rain. I guess it's going to dampen my spirit oh, today. Okay, well, here we go. Is everybody I'm starting their strategies? I'm probably doing the dumbest strategy. I'm going medium soft. Well, let's see. I'll try to stretch it. Could be the smartest. Okay, never say okay, that about me. I'm not the smartest. <laughs> Damn it, I tried to give him hope. I tried <laughs> to give him hope. He didn't take it. He didn't take the compliment. I know. Sorry. He didn't. It's here we go, lights out! And, and away, away we, go. we go! from the Grand Prix! Austrian Grand Prix, here we go on the one! Oh, I got a call by, Duke with a great by restart. John oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. oh, I told you there was gonna oh, be oh. carnage on a minute. Oh, cars around! You won't see it, of course I'm in it. Checking. Oh, Red Bull's around! That's me. Yep, you're around. I got molested. Uh... Okay, oh, old Boo gets loose! Makes a little contact with MC is here we go down the long straight. Honestly, I'm happy I'm last right now. Just oh, so I can big run, down big prey. run to the outside for MC. MC trying to take the lead. Oh, a little contact. Oh, here comes CEO into the mix as Boog's gonna let MC have the spot. But I'm catching up the pad like it's by MC tomorrow. MC getting to the lead. Chan's down in 12th. So here we go through. Third sector now. Who's gonna take? Who's gonna lead the first lap? Who's gonna take that first lap? Oh, I got an of answer. The lead here. It's not me. <laughs> it's it's gonna it's gonna be MC. He's gonna lead the first lap of the race. This is not raining oh, right away, so I don't gotta deal with the pain. Wow, look at that! Look at that! I love that shot. Yeah. From uphill, look at the elevation of the straightaway. That looked like an amazing shot. So oh, I hit that like sauce uh, on exit. Straight away. But I'm still gaining on that. Let's go ahead and see the biggest gainers of this race. I mean, the biggest um, it looks like. Uh, oh, chain wreck! Looks like. Oh, chain wreck! And Despacito. And Des yeah, Despacito's in the grass. That's going to open the door Chan. for me and Patrick. But I'm catching him, kind of. Wow. So, biggest gainers Sully up five spots. Um, Kyle Bush fan up four, uh, Callie up three, Brendan up three, biggest losers, Chan down nine, Pat down six, biggest losers of the race. I'm surprised I'm not one of them. There is your compounds everybody is on, um, is right now, my name is John, not having a good day, or I'm in 10th right now, did not have a good race at, uh, Brazil. Oh, I'm catching up to Pat, give him the bump. Well, here we go as these guys are trying to get DRS range here. Good run from Boog. Boog's got DRS. He's going to go up to the uh, up no. through the straightaway. Here we go. Oh, he actually I doesn't have dive. DRS. He was trying to take a dive. Good show. His, uh, looks like caution in Sector 3 could have been Despacito. Oh, Carter's no. Pat's going to make a move on me on the inside. Yeah, as those two are going to go down pit road. Or at least one I covered him off perfectly. Both of them went down, actually. So, already... Big problems for Chan and Despacito early on. Let's go, King Caesar, sixth place. He's got a big run on Kyle Bush fan. You wanna know something there? At least I don't gotta hear uh, Chan sometimes yell at me for nothing. Especially um well, after Brazil and that safety car came out. All I heard from like the well, final five laps is like, oh, you screwed me, this, this, and that, but uh, it's all good. Well, here we go, got a nice battle. Boog's got DRS. Here we go, up through the front straightaway. Aw, oh, Boog. Boog had a decent run going, but here we go. He's gonna have a big run down this up straightaway here with DRS and I'm catching DRS. up to like, I believe the Williams. Here we go, will he send it on the inside? Yes, battle for the lead. Boog to the front. Man, we're all draining our, I'm draining my ERS a whole lot, trying to catch up to uh, Brennan. Boog takes the lead away from MC. What a move. They're pulling away from CEO. MC looked like he wanted to go back for the lead. Here we go. This battle for the lead's looking pretty good. 
Let's go to another battle. My name's John and Sully. Those two are battling. Sully's battling Callie. Callie, after finishing second, currently eighth right now. Not the way you want to really start off your uh, race. I at least, gotta say, at least I mean, I'm like, like not one of the only ones struggling right now. Well, there's a lot. I got Wendy Goop up in seventh, trying to re redeem himself after crashing out in the last two races. Hopefully he doesn't make it three in a row. There's Kyle Busch fans still sticking with King Caesar. Caesar's looking to get a run on CB yes, fans. Here we go. Big run here from the Red Bull. Will he make a move? MC looking to the inside of Boog for the lead. He's got the inside. He, oh, here we he go. Cleared? I'm making the move on the Williams. No, yes he will. Oh, he's MC trying to cover to me off. Front. Give me the space. What a battle. Oh, here we go. Battle for the fourth spot. CB's just going to let Caesar have it. Or will CB make a comeback? We're trying to kill each other for P12 no. right now. Right now, the battle. Well, people are trying to wreck each other for about the fourth spot. So yeah, there we go. Brennan tried to chant it, like tried to block me off in the first uh, DR zone. See, Boog, this battle for the lead is gonna be intense. I mean, Boog and MC have been swapping spots the yeah. last two laps. I mean, see if it happens this time. MC had a good, good uh, final quarter, so that helped him out a lot. The thing is, Boog's not using any ERS on the straightaways with his DRS. I mean, he would get bigger runs if he used that ERS. I mean, he's just not getting a bigger run. Jeff just said that at the he... wrong time. He just said, I'm starting the gap running. Gets DRS closer to like point three. Uh, Caesar makes the pass here on CEO for the third spot. Caesar already making his way through the field, and Sully passes my name's John. My name's John passes him back. Here we go. Okay, I might I give never up thought the a battle. Here. This might be the best battle on the racetrack right now. Sully versus John versus Gaming Jake. Oh, that's a go to a three-way battle. This Gaming Jake gets 10 spot. Callie's there on Wendy Goo. Caution Sector oh, 3. KB fan. Oh, it looks like MC. No, MC. I was MC taking out KB fan last session. He lagged out. Well, if MC spins, um, he's going to fall to the 8th spot now. As Callie and Wendy Goo, this battle is still going Man, on. KJ MC and Game Jake are just battling each other. I'm, I'm gaining on them. Here we go. Cali takes that spot, but Wendy Goop's gonna have DR. Oh, a little bump right, a little hop right there from Wendy Goop. Gets his car upset. Big run from MC oh. on Wendy Goop. Well. Will he send it on the inside? Oh, Wendy Goop's gonna look to the outside of Cali. Oh, they make contact. Oh, MC's about to make it three wide. Oh, he's gonna get two for one at Kmart. Will he get two for one at Kmart? He's gonna go around the outside. Oh, they're still side by side. I don't know if I want to go like this through the corner. There we go. MC's gonna clear MC to the sixth spot. As now it's gonna be Caesar trying to catch um, Haha -ha Boog for the lead. I am. This race has been very intense. Very, very intense. I do have to say. Yeah. Rain is about like in 10 minutes or whatever. We're hearing rain in 10 minutes? Okay. Yep. Well, we probably won this one. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Caesar's slowly gaining. I mean, Boog can make a mistake. Caesar can make a mistake. I mean, it's up in the air. Is this battle right here? I mean, we got four cars that could be battling for the lead with the way this DRS train's looking. I mean, it's looking like a DRS train right now between these guys. So, there we go. Caution Sector 2. Do not know who it's for. It's right now. We're on board with Caesar. Caesar's 1.9 from Boog. So you got a battle for about six about to go on. Wendy Goop and Kyle Bush fan. Kyle Bush fan left the session, so 
It's his AI. Cali to the inside of Wendy Goop, though. This is still a battle. <laughs> I mean, these two have been going at it. Well, here we go. Moves being made with AIs in the way. Oh, big run from Cali. To the inside for the sixth spot. Well, Cali couldn't get. I guess both of them having DRS just didn't help Cali, but Cali's got DRS here. He's going to look to the inside. Will he send it? No. He's going to stay behind Wendy Goop. This race has been already a couple good battles. I mean, look, they're still battling. Cali around the outside. Oh, Wendy Goop made contact. Yo, my name is John. Just took the seven spot away. Wow. They battled so hard. My name is John is up to six. As here comes Wendy Goop. As he'll get quarter cutting, gained one place. He's coming down. Callie's also in. So pit stops are going on. I think those two damaged each other's wing. I mean. Yep. Yeah. Yep, they're both making wing replacements. And Callie has to serve a penalty, too. I mean, not Callie. Wendy Goop has to serve the penalty. Wow, they battled each other so hard, they almost wrecked each other. I mean, they almost DNF'd each other. Okay, I'm back. As that that battle was very good, but now CEO car has oh, caught Oh, Brandon lost control. There's the bow for about the second spot. Oh, Caesar with a little block. Not a little. Oh, well, maybe try to set him up, himself up for the corner. I don't think he blocked. Kind of looked like it though. Oh, see, oh, getting loose. He's in the grass. That might help CB get DRS down this next straightaway. Here we go. CB three seconds, multiple warnings. Not good for the Haas. Here we go, DRS once again for CEO, also DRS for CB, but CB's got the three seconds. Caution sector two and three, it looks like an Alphatari, that could be Wendy Goo, and it is Making Wendy the move, Goo. there we go, P10. Might get to so, two for well, this is... This definitely can help out a lot of people. I mean, Caesar's on mediums. He might go all the way. Boog's on mediums. He might go all the way until the rain. CEO's on oh. mediums. He can go all the way to the rain. Pat got loose. This Pat, Pat got loose. He's falling spots. I mean, CB's on mediums. He can go all the way, but the three seconds is really going to hurt him. I mean... Here we go. DRS for the Ferrari once again. Trying to get a run. I mean, that is not good. Dude, my throat is go. so dry. I literally, I really, I have to like, go into AI just to get water. Do we really need to know that? No. <laughs> I mean... Maybe for the guys trying to freaking pass me for P9. Oh yeah, guys, my bad if I'm wrecking you. Uh, it's because my <laughs> mouth is dry. Thank you. Um, really? I don't know. <laughs> oh my god, Sully with three seconds. Multiple warnings once again, probably for quarter cut or uh, or maybe over the uh, limits, over track limits. Wendy Goop down pit road for the second time. Wendy Goop has just not had the race. I mean, I mean, not the race, but Boog, 3.3 second lead over Caesar. Caesar in second. CEO battling Caesar in third. CEO's been hanging on. Let's see, we're gonna look to the inside cam. CEO did not go to the inside. Maybe held off a little bit right there. Oh, someone's in the pit, came back in the pits, from the pits. Is there CEO? CEO's in third. 
CB fan in fourth. Second race, you know, of course, double header, so it's his second star. Good run for CB. MC in fifth. Good job from him trying to come back after the spin from the lead. My name is John, a surprising person in the top 10 right now. He's in the sixth spot. Good job by John already. 13 laps in, P6 for the, for the Ferrari. P7, another guy we don't expect. Gaming Jake, good run from him. What an amazing run from Gaming Jake. I mean, he has had a great um, start to this race in P7. He's looking to continue. Kyle Bush fan, who I don't think has joined the back in the second. No, yeah, He's currently P8. I'm in my natural habitat. Uh, top shelf. Yeah, top shelf, you are in P9. Pat's in P10. Uh, there's Brendan in 11th. Callie in 12th. Had the replace wing and also had the pit. You know, tough for him. Despacito in 13th. Sully in 14th. Uh, Chan, who's having a bad day already to start off this race, is in 15th. He's actually a lap down right now. Wait, he Chan is? has wow. been lapped. I mean, That's fair. Not, not a good way to start out your race. And then Wendy Goop is in last, 16th. Uh, also a lap down as well. Okay, so, I just passed the uh, Kyle Busch fan. So, as a uh, Kyle Busch fan, as Chan lets by, and Chan's now dead last. Um, yep, this is not the season for Chan. You can clearly see. Oh, uh, I, mean, I am in. I'm screwed. Chan's right in front of me. He's currently a lap down. I know. He's, Chan's uh, in front oh, yeah, of me. We got to remember, lap, lap, yeah, lap cars are turned off. I mean, he can't, he can't wreck you. I mean, if he wrecks you, he wrecks himself. I mean. That's rule number one in racing. Wreck someone without wrecking yourself. Well, pit stops. MC's coming down. Uh, CB's down. CB coming out of the pits. He's on softs. I'm trying to wait this thing out. He, uh, oh! Chan's oh, caution! Chan spins it! Not a way. Yep, Chan's retired. Yeah, he, he manually retired the car. I mean, yeah. P16. After getting podium. Oh, uh, yeah. It has not been the season for Chan. Chan has not had the season he has wanted. There he goes. Parks his car. And that. Unmute my mic. 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 There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay. There we go. My battery died in my controller. I had to plug in the charger. So, well. So here we are. We are in this situation of the race now, where Boog is less than three seconds ahead of Caesar. CEO is in third, still battling with Caesar, and then you got everybody else that's trying to wait out until the rain comes. We're hearing lap 20 is when the rain is supposed to come. Strategy in this race could be crucial. We've seen how crucial this strategy can be. I mean, yeah. strategy has been very crucial. As here we go. Tires are perfect. I don't know, like 40. Green. Yeah, it's here we are. Currently up front with Boog. CB taken fourth away from Gaming Jake. Gaming Jake's now the fifth. I mean, what a day for Gaming Jake. If he can stay out for long, he's on softs too. I mean, he's gone 15 laps. I mean, I would be surprised if Gaming Jake can last until the rain comes on softs. I mean, that would be a shocker for me at least, but as he's going to let MC by as well. And then there's you in seventh. You got your eyes there on uh, on him. Brendan down pit road. Uh, Pat down pit road. Kyle Bush fans AI down pit road. Sully still on the track. Oh, John's about the battle of Cali. This is for the eighth spot. And John's gonna clear. John up to eighth. 
What a day for John. Possibly could be John's best race. Hey, John's... I mean, John's having a very good day. I mean, so you're there with Gaming yeah. Jake. This is the battle for sixth. It's Gaming Jake's just trying to make it until the rain comes. You're going to go around the outside. He's going to have to. Yeah, he, oh, no, he might be. No, no he's he got to pay, I think. Yeah. Uh, I think he, his softs yeah. probably had enough. I mean, I, I mean. So there's, there's you up to six. CEO Could car still still hanging on the Caesar by uh, DRS. I mean, via DRS, I should say. I mean, he's held on for a long time. So as they might go 20, they're definitely going to make it to lap 20. I mean, they've made 17 laps on mediums. I mean, it's definitely going to be strategy. I mean, caution sector two. Look like John, maybe John. Yeah, it was John. So John's gonna fall to eighth. Ah, uh, damn. Brendan that and Pat is gonna battle here for the tenth spot. Oh, they both spun. Hold on, Williams is spun, and oh, Brendan um, uh and Pat spun out. Wow. They both spun send out. Each other. How, yeah, they must have sent each other. I mean, that was very interesting what happened right there. That was weird, but interesting. There's, uh, there's... I, you know, it's, uh, 53. Here's the battle for so fourth. I'm it for lap two. MC and CB. It's going to be the battle for the no! fourth. Oh. I'm so you didn't need to yell in my ear. Yep, I broke my fucking... My bad. Um... Still, <laughs> what did you do? Uh, I kind of... Broke my wing. You it broke your wing? Still, uh, no. How did you break your wing? Oh, it's massive. Tried to make the corner. Fucked up. Huh. You know how I eat it. Okay. Yeah. Well, that <laughs> happened. Um, and you're breaking up. You're you're having moments where you're sounding like yep. a robot. So. As um. Hey, that's my mic. That's why I could pull. Well, there we go. Red Bull, Ferrari, hunting down the McLaren. They have gained a, uh, about now less than two tenths. To the McLaren as it's getting cloudy, it's about to rain. Folks, we might have a yeah. nice little oh, rain yeah. race here to the end. Get your umbrella. I mean, if we get a safety right, car, uh, it makes the transition maybe a little bit smoother. Maybe also save some people. I mean, as here we go. Well, wow, CEO it's car. A, it'll take me forever. CEO car did not get DRS that time, so yeah, he's not got DRS, but Caesar does. So big problems for CEO right there. I mean, he was stick sticking with him, and now he's not going to be able to stick with him as Pat's going to let. Oh, actually, no, Pat's not going to let Caesar buy. He's going to give Caesar some DRS and have Caesar catch up to Boog. I mean, Boog's been out front for a lot of this race. I mean, his pack goes off hey, into the pit, pit, pit. gravel. And is it starting to rain? Caution Sector 2. It looks like it may have been 4, Pat. So here we go. Cars are coming in. Probably taking the tires that they need. I mean... This is huge. These are huge pit stops right here. Because... This is definitely going to shake out as yep, Boog's coming down. Yeah. Caesar's coming down. Boog had a better pit entry because he cut like half of, the half of the pit entry to get into pit road. I mean, <laughs> Here we go. Intermediates going on for Jesus. the McLaren. Caesar also with intermediates. Cat's going to try over. 
Cohen, uh, MCN, CBN. DRS has been disabled, so the inners are ready. As the inters are ready. Yeah. Uh. Well, so far, no safety oh, car. Oh, right on the death, too. As Brendan's going to get lapped. So you're telling me 11th on back is now lapped down. I <laughs> didn't bother. You're breaking up wow. so badly. I mean, you need... Oh, my team said my wings. I'm my sorry bad. to the stream. He's breaking up so badly. Um, but, uh... You know, haha, ha You know, he just won Brazil in the rain. Can he do it? Can he come out and get away in caution sector two? It looks like it's a problem with somebody. It's either Callie or John that had the problem. I think it might have been somebody there. I mean, here's here we go. Not near my stupidest guy. Oh, around goes two cars. There. Somebody, Wendy Goop, and somebody else just. Wendy Goop and Pat just spun. Another two car incident. Oh, and around goes. Oh, Wendy Goop's on mediums. No wonder why he spun out. He didn't even come in for inners yet. This has yeah, not been it, a good race. I got out of the hairpin. Yeah. My favorite strategy available on the MS. It's like you waste two points out in the way. I don't go As uh, Caesar has taken the lead um, away from Boog, so this is the second time today Boog has not been out front. Remember, him and MC bowed for the lead early on, so. Um, Chris. Yeah, Chris in the lead. It's only by three seconds, though. Or not three seconds, three tenths, four tenths. Or he's probably both of He's getting buried. I mean, right now, the way this race is gone, it's gone green. I mean, I'm surprised that it's gone green. I thought we were going to have at least one safety car. So far, well, no safety cars. I mean, this, is, this race has been very clean. I do have to say, it, it's been a very clean race. With the way it's gone, CEO car trying to gain time. Last thing ahead. Caution sector two. It looks like uh, either Ferrari or uh, Alfa, Alfa Romeo. Is yeah, that race has not gone well for uh, either one of the uh, Alfa Romeos. I mean, Kyle Busch fan is not even back yet off of um. As old Caesar makes a mistake, Caesar gets touched. Caesar in the wall. That's going to be maybe some wing oh, damage shit. for the Red Bull. Sorry. It was just, I don't know. I can't blame it on somebody. It's an oh, AlphaTauri yeah. has gone around. Or problems for an AlphaTauri. Looked like Wendy Goop had it. Yeah, Wendy Goop's got issues. I mean, he has not had a good race today. I mean, it has not been a good race for this AlphaTauri. Wow, this, this has not been a good day as he's kind of... Now, he's got no wing and he missed pit road. That's going to suck. That's going to suck because when you have no oh wing and you miss pit road, it, it's not going to end well. So, so, MC goes by. Next up it, will be CB. For sure. And then, yeah, oh, God, he's going wide. Yeah, issues. As Boogs lost the lead again to Caesar, I mean... This battle for the leads getting intense. CEO has joined the mix. Well, boys, if we Brain wanted to see a crash. safety car, I mean, if we wanted to see a safety car, I mean, you're looking at the battle that can possibly bring out the safety car. I mean, CEO is, is now less than a second to the leader. He's less than a second to top shell. Uh, not top shell. He's less than, less than a second to... Um, 
Boog is here. He goes to the inside. Two for one at Kmart. No, he's not going to get two for one, but he will get second. Washington in the sector. Looks like it's going to be cleared. CEO is going to look to the outside. CEO to the lead. CEO car to the lead. What a job CEO has done. Brendan, three seconds. Oh, he must have thrown again. I mean, this is not good. Oh, hey, Wendy hey, Goop's gone on sauce. I think Wendy Goop's like, forget about it at this point. I mean, Wendy Goop at this oh, point see. just doesn't care anymore. <laughs> so you can see the rooster tails off these cars. Brain flight. In front of me. There's MC. He's starting to, uh, He's like 24 seconds behind. I don't think he has a chance. CEO car has got to get some odd seconds of penalty. I mean, he's got to get three seconds worth of time penalties. Yeah, three seconds. So he's got three seconds. Groan's got three seconds. John's got three seconds. Sully's got three seconds. Caution sector two. It looks like it's Wendy Goop again. Uh, Sully's got three. Pat's got three. And Brendan's got three as... Uh, Looks like uh, Aston Martin coming down the pits. I mean, yeah, Wendy Goop's struggling. Ten oh, second okay, time no, okay. penalty for uh, Wendy Goop for exceeding track limits. <laughs> he's still driving around with broken wing. I don't know if he's fixed that broken wing or you know he's just. Thing. You know what, I'm, I'm not even going to try at this point. It's, look, he's getting loose and he's getting tight at the same time. I mean, not been a good day for that uh, for that uh, Alph Alphatari, I do have to say. Not been a good day. Just put it down pit road already. So he's going to take the long way around as Wendy Goo gets three seconds for multiple corner, uh, multiple warnings. I guess multiple corner cuts. The CEO is pulled away from Caesar. He's pulled away about 1.8 seconds on Caesar since he's taken the lead. Another caution in another sector. Chan has now officially left the session. I mean, not a good day for Chan whatsoever. He has left the racetrack. Been not been a good day for him. Uh, CB fan, 28 seconds behind the top three. He's currently podium. Top shelf back in fifth. Callie's in about six. Is Wendy Goop? Uh, yeah, I refuse. Oh, hold on, hold on, uh, the wrong one. Wendy Goop wants an invite. He's still in the race, though. I mean, oh, he's not. He's DNS to cause a safety car. Or, okay. Of course he did. He gave me a warning. <laughs> He gave me a warning he was going to DNF, and I didn't realize it was going to be. So safety car is out. And boys, this is going to change everything. Oh, with less than 10 to go. So, um, as we're going to interview Wendy Goo. Wendy Goo. Goo. Okay, uh, invite to parte. Invite to the parte. Um, okay. And his safety cards out for the first time today. As, um, there is Wendy Goop. Hello there. So right now, this is about to be a race here. So, Wendy Goop, you got a copy there, buddy? Yeah, yeah, I do. I do, unfortunately, have a copy, yes. Okay, make sure your audio is included as, um, not a, uh, not a good day for you, man. Did not get a good start. Everything just didn't work from the start. Tell us, you know, what happened there to cause you to DNF there at the, uh, at the end here. Well, unfortunately, I did, uh, hit the back of, uh, Kyle Bushman, who was just driving like an idiot oh, so far this funny. race. And that was in the beginning. You know, that was in the very beginning of the race. 
And then all hell broke loose. Me and Kylie had some strange contact. We had quite the laugh about it. And um, I got five seconds and my race was down the drain. Uh, unfortunately, they did put me on softs whenever it started raining, even though I asked for inters. And then they did it a second time, and then I unfortunately did wreck out. But my team was being absolutely idiotic there. Unfortunate for the Alpha Tower okay. team being very stupid. Yep. So that's just how the race went. Yeah. Yeah, yeah mine are only like 20. Horrible race. I'm chilling. Um, for you and you know you're you're in the battle okay. of a battle between you and top shelf here for that final playoff spot tell us you know what what you gotta hope for now since you're not gonna get any point any points for your day i gotta hope for top shelf to either get seventh or worse because that's uh that's the borderline right there wait i have to get seventh or worse yes I don't know what the point standings is between them two. I don't so know I'm going to get a 10-point penalty because of, quote, intentional wrecking, even though it was unintentional. Fine. I'm not going to protest it, though. It's fine. Um, it wasn't so, intentional. I just dealt with it. Oh, Pat almost spun it. Uh, let's see. So what was the okay. gap going into the race? Let me. The gap going into the race was 18 points. So allow me to uh, enlighten you here. They're just like that. <laughs> Allow me to enlighten you here. Oh my god. So, he okay, is 18 points back. Start of the race. So, let's see. So, with me DNFing and getting a 10 point penalty. So, that is just minus 10. So, he is 8 points behind oh, shit. currently. Okay. Let's go. And due to Formula 1's point system and the point system of this league, he would have to get 6th place to tie me. But you would still get to the shit, I think. And I would keep the position due to the tiebreaker, which is win. So, he if he finish, he just has to finish above sixth place. That's his deal. He has to finish above. It's only place. Well, that easy said than done. Well, right now he is in fourth, and there is this chaotic restart that's about to happen. So some things might happen here. There could be quite like the playoff implications. Around. Yeah, there would be quite the playoff implications right now is it is about to be a battle but um you know tell us you know uh it's definitely going to be a struggle for you for these rest of the races tell us what is going to be your mindset now after crashing depending if you make it or not you know if i make it obviously it's going to be maximized points don't be an idiot don't you know slack off like i did in the regular season um which I'm, I'm not exactly worried about getting into the playoffs, but if I do, then that'll be wonderful. And I will have to persevere and try my best to just gain points. I think Imola will be a strong track for me here in this first round. But um, if I don't make it, then I will just be running for wins. And, uh, you know, checkers or wreckers uh, will be the mindset for sure at that point. Okay, well, congrats, well, congratulations on 15th, and uh, <laughs> we'll oh see my you God. Uh, next. We wish you good luck for the next cross race. Oop, safety car in the slot. Playoff right, implications safety, right here. Safety car is in this lap. I got six laps to do this. Oh boy, I just gotta stay put. I just gotta stay Actually, put. We'll be going green with five laps oh, remaining. Yes. Here from Austria. This if I get a podium, sorry to, if you hear me yelling. This race is about to come down to this restart. Unless another safety car comes out, this restart could decide the whole race. CEO car in the lead. Then it's Kyle Busch fan. Then it's Boog. Then it's... Oh, oh! Boog spins it! Boog spins it off the start! Wow! Oh, but he's still there. Oh, we got cars going around them. Cars trying their best. A lot of lap cars. It's top shelf. In fourth still. Five laps remaining. Oh, oh he got loose. gets loose. Still a lot of lap cars in the way. This is going to be interesting. There's still a buffer. Oh, here we go. Boog slides it in. He hit the back of Caesar. 
Is this might be a battle. There we go. We're going to be coming to four laps remaining this time. Lap car gets to the inside. Lap car is affecting top shelf so much right now. It's freaking racing me so hard. Like, I'm going for third. You're somebody this who's not going to get points. This battle like, right here. I think that is not... I don't think that's actually somebody... Uh, is that somebody? Who? Oh, yeah, that is Pat. Let's, here we go. This battle could be possibly a chance to send somebody to the playoffs and somebody home. So oh the God, thing is, so even, even if... Let's see, four remaining. We're going to be coming to three to go this time. Yeah, oh why is he racing me so fucking aggressive? Oh, Boog! Oh, this battle right here is about to get intense. Pat's now going to the inside of Boog. Remember, lap cars can be ghosted. Are ghosted, so you can't have any problems with lap cars. Sorry. Oh, little taps into the back of uh, Boog. Pat's throwing me off my line and shit. By. Here we go. Oh, this battle is definitely important. Here we go. See Did a lap car just already. try to freaking send me? CEO is literally... I know. 4.8 ahead. He is far away, but this is the battle we want to see. This is about to involve second through six here because the second through six is in about a line right here oh, of everyone fuck. so you got this is the only thing that's helping top shelf though right now um grown does have three seconds so oh, even shoot. if grown passes them grown needs to get three seconds ahead and here we go big run from top shelf Oh, Boo gives a bump to the back of Caesar. Oh God, three wide. Around goes MC. MC, Drone loses a spot. Cali to fifth. Top shelf to second. Boog's up to third. He's battling Caesar. Three, we're coming to two laps remaining this time. Dude, uh, dude, is right now, Callie's in fifth, Groan's in sixth, Gaming Jake with a P7, what a race for Jake. I'm nervous as hell right now, dude. J my, my name is John, what a great finish right now in ninth. Pat's in tenth, Sully's in eleventh, they got a battle. Oh, boys. There's Brendan in twelfth, Kyle Bush fans AI, and then Despacito in fourteenth. But CEO with two laps remaining. Is sitting up here seven seconds in front of everyone. And so here we go, up the straight. Oh yeah, there it's like four or five cars in one group for second. Come on, drive away, this drive away, drive away, drive away. About to be good job. This is about to be a good finish. Caution sector two. So there's a caution up ahead. Or a caution somewhere. It looks like it is Brendan. Not been a good day for him. But here we go. This battle is going to intensify. Callie around the outside of Boog. For the fourth spot. He's going to get it. Boog's dropping back after being first and second for most of this race. Here we go. And CEO out of the final corner. White flag. One more lap remaining in the Austrian Grand Prix. Boog with three seconds. Gaming Jake, three seconds. Oh, Boog's retired. Boog's crashed out. This is the last lap of the regular season. Caution Sector 3. Brendan's also crashed out of the race. This is going to be... I might actually freaking do this. Oh, my God. A walk-off. Victory for CEO as he is going to get his second win or maybe his first win. I don't remember if he's won I think yet it's this his second. season. But here we go. Boog has left the session. 
As John gets loose, here we go. Just nurse it, just nurse it. Sorry if I do yell if I get this. Well, boy, I'm just gonna warn you. There might be a headphone, a headphone user, user headphone warning, folks. It's here we go, for the through the final sector for the final time. CEO is gonna go through the final corner, and he is going to win the Austrian Grand Prix. What a race from CEO! And through the final corner, yes! we're finally go! gonna get it. Yes! Top yes! podium. Let's go! Oh my God! And top shelf is also going to make the playoffs. Yes. As Caesar brings it home third, as a Red Bull podium one two. What a job! Yes. Top. That top shelf podium we were finally promised is Everything. going to happen. Yes! Yes! Thank you, Chris. Oh my god, I can't believe... Thank you. Oh my god, finally! Whoa. Put out legend in B2. Absolute unit. What a race. Yes! What a race. Top shelf podium. I never thought I would see the day, but today, the day has come. Yes! Sloppy Toppy gets a post. <laughs> Finally! Wow. <coughs> Screaming. Finally. God, That's redemption. Finally happened. Redemption. Wow. Let's look at results. CEL Carr gets, I think, his first or second win of the season. Second win. So he becomes the fourth winner this season for multiple multiple wins. Um, now it was close. Top shelf gets second, Somehow. Caesar third, Cali fourth. What a race indeed! As we're gonna interview your top three, we're gonna start with Caesar in the uh, in the Red Bull today, getting major points for Red Bull. Caesar, you got copy there, buddy. Make sure your audio is included. Uh, I was asking if you can have your audio included. I was just oh, <laughs> okay. What a what a race for you, man! You were battling hard with um, uh, Mark right there, or I should say Boog. Tell us, you know, what what happened, or what more did you need there to see if you maybe had a shot at CEO? Because it looked like as soon as you and Boog battled, CEO just went right on by you guys. I was trying to help Top Show get the podium. I wasn't really trying. I kind of told CEO Car was let him win. But yeah, we got the top shelf podium, so that's a W. Overall, it was a good race. But like, if we went green, I could have beat him. But I got wing damage, but it's fine though. Just another podium. Another podium in the books for you. Playoffs are now going to start. You're definitely the favorite right now to get your third championship in this series. Tell us what is going to be that mindset now going into the playoffs. Just be consistent and try to win as much as you can, because that's the only way you're going to win a championship. Yes, and then, uh, of course, uh, final question. Uh, today, you know, great finish for Red Bull for Constructors. Top Shelf and you get podiums. Tell us how much is that going to really help you guys in Constructors, knowing that Ferrari is not having the last good couple of races. We'll see a car on, so there will be points there. But, yeah, I think we could get it now. I mean, Aston Martin's making a good run out of it. And overall, yeah, we just have to be consistent. We'll win the Constructors. Okay, well, congratulations on your podium. We wish you good luck here in the playoffs, man. As uh, now we're going to go ahead and, and we finally got the interview he wanted. He it took him being in race reporter as well to get him a podium today. I'm surprised. I'm just surprised. Just hold on. Hold on, hold on here. There we go. Okay, my mic, uh, my uh, my controller died again. So, um, <laughs> the, the top shelf. You got a copy there, buddy? Or I know your audio. Yes, included, I do. But uh, what a job today, man! Finally, you get the podium that you've always wanted. Tell us what was what was the goal here today 
uh, the strategy to really help you? Was it the safety car that helped you, or was it staying out on those mediums to put you in the position for that restart? Well, honestly, I just went into the race thinking, you know, like just try to get some points, you know, not expecting that anything really. And then I just went mediums, and it was a big brain decision. Then the, it just started raining on the safety car, helped me a whole lot. And then we went three wide on the straightaway, which was surprising that I made the move and pulled away, thanks to Chris. But hell, we finally did it. It's been re it's been redemption. It's been done. Um, you know, you're you beat Wendy Goop out for the spot. Um, uh, it was a great job by you. Um, tell us, you know, what's going to be your expectations now heading into the rest of the season. Um. Well, basically, I got that first point, and uh, I'll try to build on it even more in the playoffs. Just got to be consistent and everything. Don't make dumb, de dumb decisions. That's good. And then tell us, you know, today, Red Bull second and third. Pretty good run for you guys. Tell us, you know, constructors are looking pretty tight between you, Ferrari, and uh, Aston Martin's making a run at, we heard. So tell us, what's going to be that plan uh, for at least the team-wise going into the playoffs? Well, I know Chris will get do his best just to get wins and all that. I'm just going to try to get solid points for us, like like I've been doing all year. So, Well, congratulations on your podium, man. Uh, we Thank wish you. you good luck in the playoffs. It's time to celebrate. All right, see you guys. Okay, it is time to celebrate. This will go to CEO, who wins the race today. Um, CEO, you got copy there, buddy? Yep. What a win, man. Uh, going out there, second win of the season. Um, that pass you made for the lead, tell us, you know, what, uh, what happened right there uh, to make you catch them? Was it those two battling each other hard, or did you finally find pace in that car to catch up to them? Well, I th it was mostly them two battling, and then whenever uh, Chris got wing damage, he started holding, uh, holding him up, yeah. Yes, what a what a race from you! Two wins on the season puts you uh pretty uh pretty well uh job, um this season uh, fourth multi time winner this season. Uh, tell us, you know, you're in the play. You're, you're I think you're in the playoffs as well. Uh, tell us, you know, what's going to be the expectations here for the rest of the season uh, coming up? Try to keep consistent and uh, go on for the championship. Okay, um, and then final thoughts here. Constructors is looking pretty tight between you, uh, Red Bull, and uh, Aston Martin. Tell us, you know, what's going to be the the expectation here because it looked like the last couple of races Ferrari has not been running well, and then you get the win here today, but Red Bull also gets second and third in the race. Uh, both of, uh, both drivers need to get consistent. Uh, don't make as many mistakes show up okay well congratulations on your win and we wish you good luck here in the playoffs yep that was redemption for portugal wow is there's your winner ceo and if i had to take one guess hmm, let me guess cali won the uh regular season title no i just no? want to be here <laughs> oh, he just wanted to be here. I believe okay. it's Chris. Well, Chris, well, I wanted to hear it on top shelf. But he did nothing special, so. Yeah, oh, that I man screamed at his mic. He was so happy, so. But thank you, everybody, tuning in and watching. Hey, uh, Eric, Eric, this is yeah. Justin. What? Uh, there is going to be a 13 man playoffs. 13 man playoffs, so they're going to add. I will be into the playoffs due to a tie, and he's not going to do a tiebreaker. Wow, doing a tie. So a 13-man playoff. So after all, Wendy Goop will make the playoff. So great job for, for you. Just make sure you don't crash because you've now crashed in the last three races. Five uh, races in a row. Actually. Five races in a row. So um, thank you, everybody, for tuning in and watching. What a double header! We have streamed for over two hours now. Um, the longest stream in UPS history. Um, thank you, everybody, for tuning in and watching. We'll see you guys for the playoffs uh, coming up. I'm Eric Discause. Signing out. Peace.